simu when you na watch eh. jitu itaenda bana nikaingia kwa mat kakana besti yangu anaitwa Masi nikafungua video eh hey, uo dem amekungutwa amekula vizuri eh hey, dem tu hapo ni kelele kelele video ikaisha i call Sandra nikamuuliza natokea wapi because i thought most probably uo dem nilikuwa mahali maybe face yangu ilionekana maybe it was you know you can be in a public place people are doing their thing here and you didn't know so you you were passing and then your face was so i asked her natokea wapi mimi Akaniambia wanasema huyo dem ni wewe. <laughs> I watched that video five times. Ama ni mimi, ama nishawahi kungutwa hivi na sijui. Ama nishawahi. Atazidi alikana uliza beste yangu hapo. Ama ni mimi huyu na sikojua. Atazidi juzi alikana. Sia metrend juzi. Mtu anajiulizanga. Ama ni mimi na sikumbuki. Eh, ni kama tukichekiwa mimba high school. Unajua kabisa we ni vajo ujaguzwa lakini unatetemeka. Ama nili ama nilifanywa na sijui. Ama nilienda ma you get in me. Ama ilifika hii kiwango na sijui. Ai, but it gave me stress. No matter acha nikwambie. That time uki mm. atakiwa hivyo don't forget your mom mm. don't forget so many people are, are, are looking up to you or rather there is your own image mm. so ili ni affect Alafu, kumbuka, you are in a meeting wakati nilijua walikuwa na meeting walikuwa na, na ni rehearsal zenyu za band walikuwa mm. na rehearsal za band aliomba ruhusa juu walikuwa na rehearsal siku akuje nilika nilijikwel kwa bed unashindwa utatoka aje unajua wewe sio wewe unajua <laughs> lakini matusi zenye umepewa zimeanza kukuingia umeanza kujiuliza ama huyu ni mimi ama ama nishaimitua msee na sijui na ilikuwa ya Pornhub kama eh ilikuwa sijui Telegram mm. now so many people now when when so many people are like oh see shiro hata hiyo hiyo nywele yenye ameweka hata sidhani nice anaweza yaka all her life unaona mm. but nikiangalia huo dem kuna venye mdomo, mdomo tunaweza fanana <laughs> tunaweza fanana unajua una, lazima uangalie why people so so many people were like ni nani huyo alifanya hii kitendo mm. oh, oh, oh. and then so many women came i know her i know her paka saa zingine nawaambia simu nipe basi namba utamwanika mwambie mm. sitamwanika juu unajua if i'm feeling like this and it's not me what about her mm. so i just wanted her to to know that sita share anything kumhusu but to tell her it is it is okay don't commit suicide because i know people can commit suicide people who kuinje people it's bad trolling is bad people can do things ni venye estimi yetu imepanda kitambo liko unapewa hizo lines za ufala ina ku demoralize unakuwa you are nobody unajua but then ni kweli watu believe Imagine kama hiyo kitu ni 2019 bado kuna watu mm. wana comment kwa video kwa kwa, 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 kwa kioko mtu anasema atisita wai sahau de macha united, united, united Kenya, Kenya. United, mm. eh, eh. united Kenya hata saa hizi kuna mm. naweza weka video hata mm. saa zingine niko 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 mahali ama just normal the normal posts that we make mm. na mtu hapo tu ataandika ati eh usisahau nilioje kinembe yako <laughs> uko what is going on as in you know you know it's not you but i move on 2019 hey and i'm like i think size ni kona too much of thick skin it doesn't affect me but mm. your time hey my friend my dear mm. ay 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 the following day nafika tao mm. niliva baseball <laughs> <laughs> na nini ndio watu wasinijue juu nilikuwa naenda rehearsals KNT. Mm. Kufika si ndio nikaanza kukoliwa na namba sijui zinanitisha do. Mm. Hai nilienda central tuka report. <laughs> DCI mpaka akachukua manamba zenye ana, anataka kujua huyu mwenye anaitisha pesa ni wa wapi wakajua kwa umo. Lakini sasa DCI haezi fanya kazi bila wewe kumchotea. Eh bila pesa. Anataka 20k kwanza kuna mwingine anataka 80k asikie pale. Sasa yeye ni 20 atume mtu. Eh. Hey. Bado hawajamshika, akishikwa bado utatoa ingine. Imagine. So Ay. mimi nikajiuliza, "Hey, mnatafuta mtu mwenye sijamtumia pesa? Huyo mm-hmm. sio mimi." Hakuna venye inaniambia. Sio mimi. Na huyo mdem sio mimi. Exactly. So 
am I paying 20k for sub that is not my tape that is not me in an if up on the only you know god what I, I, I even called my person in Gambia yeah shetani ya meni ya mulia kweli kweli kumbe pia ili wafikia unajui na wacha ni kwambie inafikiangadi wazazi inafikiangadi wazazi hehe Eh? Eh, ni kama eh, mimi, ni kama mimi nani kuna msewu ana kona se, mm-hmm. anajiita munga hii Facebook. So me went to the DC. I wanted him to get arrested maybe or to pay you SIM card or yes, something. Yes, yes, And then yes. they were asking for 80,000. Yes. Mimi nisha address mara mingi hiyo sio account yangu. yangu. Yes. Wewe ukienda pale uko niwe. Si nishauri yako. Sasa mimi nitoe 80,000 mtu ashikwe. Hata ni usu it, it's none of sense. my business. So at that time ndio nani my manager hiyo time Mato. daddy Mato mm. ali come through immediately your case imeshika akaniambia breathe in breathe out cuz you can either cuz alijua niko broken of course we are baby girls ah wezi kosa eh hata kitu sio wewe lazima ikuhat and and he was like you know what clearly hata wewe sio wewe kabisa so what we should do let us contain e we made a post literally he edited and then before that like ni kama zili align a god two days was it two days before i had taken a photo shoot a photo shoot nikiwa nimekalia makuni mahali nikiwa nimevaa cowboy mm. unajua wa makobo utaka hiyo hiyo nini nimekalia kuni so the dimato made a video of and we posted kuni zenye najua <laughs> kukalia ni hizi <laughs> you know and then we took cause there was so many people walikuwa natukana na vibaya na ni wengine ni wamama just to, to to shame them we took all the text and we posted mm-hmm. ndio watu wa feel shame on you you're a mom you're a mother you're what are you doing as mm-hmm. in most of them even age ilikuwa ina ni age pia ya mama yangu most these souls zina kamingi kutoka kwa wamama imagine mm. na ni wamama you like people have even if that let's say that was me mm ni shoot kitu kama hiyo nilichukuliwa na kitu kama hiyo mm. kuna fantasies ya watu wengi sana ku shoot mkifanya kitu na boy wako ama mm. mnini you know when you're doing that I, i'm sure we were them mm. hako amejiambia itawai leak alikuwa mm. maybe ni ku satisfy the boy fantasy yake ama pia fantasy ya we were them walikuwa na jibamba that means they had something either there was love either there was communication because mm. i'm sure we dem alikuwa anajua hiyo camera iko because it was so close mm. haiko inaonekana kama imewekwa mahali ama juu ama nini so a mother coming or me as a woman ililikiwa sababu maybe someone was angry with that lady mm. someone was angry someone just wanted to shame her and you as a woman you still go there and shame her more It's like you don't know how it feels to be betrayed. It can be just that betrayal of sex. Mm. It can be betrayal of being cheated down. It can be betrayal of just a friend who has how did you feel when you loved someone and then they did something to you? Mm. Mostly no one talks about the bad things in or the good things people did in any relationship. Mm. We talk the bad and the good. Kila mtu ako na njia zake, but eh hey, sex tape mimi nilinifanya letin came home. Hey, nilikuwa natetemeka. Ananiambia don't worry, don't worry, we will contain this. And then after 3 4 days it went down. Mpaka nika I think hapo nilienda mpaka the train. Eh. Ai, hapo macho akaniambia publicity is publicity because bado siko na ka thick skin. Kalikuwa sasa ndio kana kama. Yeah. You know when you go through a lot in life, how mm. kwangi na thick skin until you meet the right people and the right circle where you feel now you can be vulnerable and actually they listen and actually they give you that motivation and support that you need. So your time ndio ka thick skin sasa kalikuwa macho alini help saidi yake kuna latin kuna family when you are help sana ku, ku, ku spread also the good words there and and then i had fans mm-hmm. when you're genuine fans they're not just there for my downfall mm. they really love what i do so those fans when you wana nijua na majority of people now they came with good news mm. zile za come on we see your nice ni 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 they knew kabisa so it, it became like shame on you all of you who mm. thought that she will fall and die and actually never act again what about after divorce mm. after, i mean separation eh hey, after separation well, le, 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 le. i think that one i was ready oh. i wasn't ready actually to talk about it and i've never talked about it i i have never talked about it in mm. 
in in length mm. well, hata hujafanya interviews mm. mingi mm. sijafanya interviews sana. mingi mm. so um separation was really bad cuz hiyo time ndio 2018 nimewin AMVCA for the first time nimepanda ndege nimeenda Lagos nimewin and then ndio ikanounce wa siku anti boss mm. which what people didn't know ni ilikuwa before hata wins ilikuwa before hata ni kuwe nominated mm. since even when i was nominated kuna venye siku anounce wa na wao mm. so that means they knew i'm not coming back you see but now we didn't tell people because kipindi bado ilikuwa naonekana kwa TV. Huko ume eh, sikuwa zimeisha. So nikijua the last episode in a, a kesho, so it's the high time now you tell people rather than telling them alia. Na bado unaendelea kuonekana unaweza kuonekana kwa TV, you know. So ilikuwa hiyo. So that means nimetoka huko na nataka kujishikilia kinaisi. Sana shoot vitu za nice wanjeri and iki happen hivyo you know when divorce happens ama separation happens what did it a divorce kabisa kabisa but you guys were married not legally oh. not legally mm. he never went to to see my mom at any particular time mm. at you eh niliona kwa blogs for the 9 years eh for the 9 years i st- I, I pushed as a woman mm. but mtu kama akupendi tu wanawake si kwa wajinga Mm. si si nasemanga even if mtu ali kufanyia mambo ama nini tunaionaga ni vile you want to push mm. Nine years is long for someone not to see that hata waje watu wataniita mjinga i felt stupid you, you know there is that there is one thing ladies ladies sisi tu kwa ambao tulikuwa kwa relationship fulani imeisha inakuanga if it's long you once it imeisha kabla u, u regain yourself you really blame yourself so much not because the relationship has failed but because you you saw the signs but you still continued persisting you knew this guy kabisa miaka fulani hayanzangi mwaka wa pili inazanga even the first year you start dating but you like you know what I will stick around and be here. Second year in Aisha, third year mama yako anakuambia, "Yo, this guy will kill you. This guy will do something to na whiskey." Mabeshte wana come around. I have friends and and why I didn't talk it because majority of people who knew me, they knew the exact thing what was happening. They knew Nice was broken. They knew Nice needed to get away from that man. They knew Nice has made the best decision ever. Most of them even tempt it was the high time because they knew how much I would be broken each and every time. Wamemuona akini hurt hivi na macho. People have come through for me where you're being hit. Umegongwa kofi mbele ya watu because maybe he misbehaved and you came I was a public figure kutoka kitambo. So, mm. nikiingia anti boss, I expect also my man bana anikamie through ni siibike unanishika so akienda kitu a behave vingine bana unakuta na made mama behave alikuwa na host karaoke zaki misbehave umuulize hata kama mko peke yenu ega bana what ah watu wananijua hata pia wanakujua hata kama uko na indifferences na mimi ficha ficha kiasi utagongwa kofi and people wako hapo na hakuna kitu watadu you know and and i have friends who have come through mtu anaona umegongwa kofi yeye alisikia kwa zile za aki manze mbona hamkuingilia hiyo kitu hmm? we have um, and because i had friends ambao pia hawakuniachilia as much as to unajua hii generation nikikwambia wache Trevor sasa hii <laughs> siku ya kwanza ya pili ya tatu generation ya Said sisi watoka wacha basi mtesane nini time yetu ukiwa na uo mtu anakutesa a narcissist ulikuwa kabisa uo mtu hakutoki mabeshto wangu hawako nitoka pa walinitoka yes but they still were around but now Wanu normally best. yes narcissists make sure you don't have friends every friend you have around they make sure wame kutoa sa hizi if, if i can i can kunaweza kuja mabeshte hapa wa sita wa saba This is a true story and I can shut up and they can talk about my life not me telling them them watching 
them watching and what kama kina milichebi that's why you will see comments zile za you deserve all the happiness in the whole world that is why you will see Pauline Mukiri we were we were friends cuz to be answer the name Mukiri Mudhoni wa Mukiri ni sister Mudhoni Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mudhoni oh, yeah, anaitwa Pauline. Oh. So tulikuwa tunamuita Pauline but the Mukiri tumewaka na ameiona, ame experience, ameiona yani nice akitritua trash na ha, na nice I get. But now what people don't know it's because ukitritua trash na uitikie kutritua trash it's because you never loved yourself in the past first place. You you didn't take time to know who you are as a person. And if you check closely, it all goes back and it trickles down to your childhood. How were you treated when you were a child? Did you work so hard to get love? My mom gave me love. That one it's 100%. My grandma gave me love, you know? But now when you grow up uh, and then my dad apparently my dad was not my real dad, but he never treated me different from my other siblings. So my brother we were loved equally. But now the other family when they treat you but you need to una feel kuwa kada kupendwa. So you simp a lot and it works. As a child it works. Utakuta unafuliwa huyu nguo amekupenda wiki mzima. So hamja kuorol, you know, it becomes a norm. You start gaining that from your a childhood. Watoto wa siku hizi unafanya mtoto wa so hard umpende even in the family facility. Mm. You don't know that will mess them up when they grow up. High school mean nimelipiwa shule. So that means there is no any day you can be yourself. You have to simple throughout because you're like if I do something am I say kule mtu hani treat vizuri na maybe let's say ni anko yangu ama ni auntie yangu hani treat vizuri na pesa inatoka kwa bana yake kiasi ya shule yangu that means ni kibonga huyu ananitesa ii utasoma ii utasoma itakatwa so what do you do you simp you still act up you're the good girl you you know nini nini by the time you're 18 19 years old and you meet a guy this guy shows you mapenzi you are a teenager for god's sake you have never been loved like that this guy takes you wild in a different place mwezi ya kwanza ya pili you start feeling i am not working so hard to get this love mm. and then it ficas like maybe one year down the line you start noticing akona ma phone calls mingi na madem and when you ask he gets angry but because you don't want kale kautamu kenye uli experience first year kakupendwa bila ku work so hard What do you do you simp and you kata you will never ask questions you know so when things happen in a relationship ama he does something there was a time my first time he slapped me sita why how i was two months pregnant i was two months pregnant this is something i've never shared and tunafaitia nini remote ya tv we had e tv ya matako acha niite hivyo you know your time eh. so um, we we'll just continue from there mm. uh, yeah, interesting my first I child uh-huh. i remember nilianza kupoa pressure za 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 i was a good girl kutoka kitambo chat girl wale wa kwenda mpaka nini kesha from morning na nikesha ya maombi I would not do any job without consulting God. Till now I do that without consulting God. There are some jobs that many toa zinakuwa na scandal suku nje mm-hmm. na ikataa kumbe ni God ameisema do I ask. Mtu akini call hata unicall sahi uniambie unanipea contract sahi na ni ya milioni. First I will say ni pay 10 minutes I consult. Si eti na consult anyone. I am ni hata nikiwa kwa huyo anaweza Latin can tell you I will I will not kneel down but I will I hold her, her, his hand if we are together and I god if this is for me give me a sign and it happens every job I've done hakuna job nimefanya ikakuwa wamelagai watu mm. and hiyo time nilikuwa church girl blah blah I met him alikuwa mtu wa mira sa zingine hapa ka, ka, ka nini unajua raha si pia alikuwa mmyang mm. tulikuwa set books jicho for and then from kitambo napenda kuimba yeye alikuwa pia naimba imba hapa pale mm. so when he was in when when we introduced each other and we, we became friends 
nilimwambia kama mimi unataka kunidate lazima bana watane na hizo raha za veve sijui nini jumia was not into any of those yeah. mimi please mimi ni wachach and you know the guy aliacha pombe na hizo vitu for 2 years <laughs> mbona usi believe <laughs> unapendwa mbona usi believe this guy has left and then for those 2 years i used to also to still go to church the third year now is like now 2010 uh, when i was now 20 nikiwa now junior meet nikiwa 19 mm. 20 tuka, tukaanza ku date nikiwa 21 Nikiwa 20, jua was a good girl na utaki good girl waende akaanza ama tupate mtoto. Nikamwambia mimi hapana, madhe, madhe akaniambia, "Kai nice. Omenyewe Nairobi do kagei hu." Nikamwambia, "Mom, you know me because my mom really trusted me and I knew that I would not do that to her." Aki mm. I knew because mm. I was this girl mwenye manzee jo umejipanga. Mimi mm. ni first born, mi bana naangalia pale mbele. Wajeri re. At 21 nikasakam to let us get pregnant. I am li agree. At eh hey, tuli agree hapo ati tupate mimba. <laughs> Haina noma sawa sawa. And then nilikuwa na work jicho for. Nilikuwa nime save kutoka work town ni mimi nikale ka dem kakusave hapa pale. I had 40k in my own account. So I knew mm. definitely ah 40 itanipeleka mimba yote na nipate mtoto na kire. 40k. That that time una, unasikia niko napata mimba ujue 20 nilikuwa mjinga. <laughs> Tunaishi huruma. Ngei one. Ngei one, if anyone is here and ajua ngei one wapi, yani sewage zilikuwa zinatoboka kila siku. Yani you are full, every day you are bloated. Mm. Sisemu wenye mnaishi huko, uh, uh, maisha ni maisha. <laughs> Mtu wana lazima useme, this is my story where yeah. I started. And I'm telling you, nilikuwa, kanyumba kalikuwa 2,500. Kalikuwa naka, unaona tule tudirisha tuwa choo, mm. tuwenye tunakuanga hauoni ndani, but mm. ni kadogo. Ilikuwa na dirisha ina tosha na ibo. Ako tu. Mm. Ako tu. Walls ujaribu tu uvae uguze wall, unaenda na hiyo rangi yote job. Sitting room, siku, sinika room kama oja, choo muna share na everyone kwa ploti. Mm. Bafu muna share na everyone kwa ploti. Mm, I had yeah. a castove. Usikia sina adabu. Mm. Usikia sina adabu. Kitanda ndiyo hii nyuma ya kitanda ndiyo napikia. Na bado wa jeli, haka enjoy na haka pata mimba. Mm -hmm. Who the hell? Mm -hmm. Kupata mimba, two months down the line, <laughs> TV ndiyo hii. Tu, nikanunua, nilikuwa napenda, iyo time kulikuwa kumetokea hizi songs za nani Morgan Heritage. Mm -hmm. Asi ya girl on the corner. Izo sa zilikuwa zimeiva, zilikuwa unatengenezewa CDs. So, for some reason, emotions, ama hormones, really loved that yes, so. mixture. So, nikabai yo. Yeye alikuwa napenda reggae roots. Roots zina nisinya. Saizo nikona mimba zina nisinya. Jame ni sitaki. Mm. Kambia, ilikuwa hii, na, na kulikuwa na hii song. Nice to, nice to know you, let's do it again. Ilikuwa ina play back to back, I will never forget. Paka mm. sipendi yo song, hata kama ikona jina ya nice, sipendi. Mm -hmm. Ilikuwa ina play back to back. <laughs> Na isikia kwa mind na inini na ndiyo na play. Imagina kwa kwa. Eh, haka play mara katha, mara katha. Nika muomba, nika mambia, sawa, wacha hii time, nime kuchukue ten minutes, uskize yako. Alafu waki unipepi ya mimi nisikize. Sawa. Haka sikiza ten minutes. Mimi mpaka na time, ten minutes zikaisha. Sasa ye yako na remote, nikaenda kuchange CD. Hey, nilitoa, nikifinya nini ya DVD, Sia kwa na remote, anafinya inarudu. <laughs> Nikifinya ikitoka, nikienda kuweka CD yangu, anafinya inarudu. Uh, <laughs> si tumeongea nini, nini, mimi sijui slapi litoka wapi. We were arguing about, wacha kutoa niweke, nini. <laughs> Kwanza hile, sinajui hile ukikuyu, nijue ni tuasamanga ya kemanyo, koya nyuma. Ui, ni ya madharao, hii ni ya madharao. Kofia hapa, saa, hii, haikuwa ready. <laughs> Manze jo ni kajichore hapa pote. Nili, by the way, nilishindwa kumuvu. I give the sad story like it. Eee, I know. Nili, saizi I can laugh. Back then, nilikuwa, I can't go onga. Oh my God, that means ni me heal. Hey, mimi kwanza nika, nika sikia kizungu zungu, nika muangalia. And that time, eh, ni mimi ama si ni mimi. Ni me gongwa, nika ambia, ni mimi ume gonga. Paka ime jichora hapa. Sawa, narudi kwetu. Sisao sijambia mamu ni kona mimba. Narudi kwetu. Kambia inakata utaki umtoto naenda kuwa boat. 
naenda kutoa mimba aliniambia sasa hizo niko 2 months akaniambia kama una feel ni haja ya kutoa enda utoe hivyo <laughs> ndio aliniambia nikapack ka bag fulani hapo tunguo twangu juzi kwa na nguo mingi niliacha zingine na nikatoka nikamwambia sawa tutaona acha nirudi kwa mama mama yangu aliniambia nisiwai gongwa na mtu mm. na nikatoka and then back then sijui ni nini mwili yangu ilikuwa ina react nilikuwa na ukiona mimba kuna dizziness fulani ukam for like twice or thrice nilikuruma na nunua kitu na shikiliwa naambia mpaka mwenye tuko na nishikilie ni yangu ivo as in ivo nishikilie 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 nakukuka so hiyo time ilikuwa time ya kizunguzungu mob nimepaka nguo hata kabla nifike downstairs nishajishikilie hiyo ni kana sikia ku faint lakini hajali mimi nikachukua gari nikafika koja throughout nikiwa koja lari nyambare pale uplands nikachukua gari ya uplands <laughs> nikaingia kwa matatu na nikalipa wadau machozi ilianza hapo because this guy is not calling me back haya ajali hajali i texted him a lot of text telling him hata naona ujali unataka ni about not any text that was replied yeye ndio amenigonga i have it sijamtukana i really tukana watu sijamtukana okay do you know nililia through a dilika kwa dirisha so nilikuwa na face kwa dirisha Now you know how women who are pregnant they know how emotional we get especially when you're pregnant right now I'm crying at anything now on TV mtu amehagiwa why did they have to hug like that mm. so your time liko na lia na lia na lia nikafika place kunaitwa ngarariga kutoka ngarariga mpaka home you can pay that 50 bob sai mm. nilishuka before nifike home mm. nika call mama yangu i had told my mama mna come home akaniambia ni nini Nikaambia na come home eh nani amenigonga amekugonga kaambia eh hata uso yangu imefura side moja amenigonga kofi he mwana wako da kugothwa kuja <laughs> nimefika nimefika gararika kitu ikani show natupa hii hii juu ya slap <laughs> natupa kitu nime experience two years juu ya slap relationship nikaangalia simu haja text haja call Wanjeri alishuka gari nikachukua gari ya kurudi Nairobi sikufika huko <laughs> Wadau is in this is in Urogi <laughs> nikachukua gari nikarudi home nikafika huruma Gai. I knew sikuwa nimepika mm. Wanjeri they went and bought chipo for him chipo for myself and two sausages each mm. Sinajua sikupika na najua sirudi anajua sirudi lakini sitamwacha alale nja nikarudi nyumbani nikaingisha mkono kwa kale kanyumba ka 2500 nikafugua alikuwa amekaa kwa kitanda na fegi sijai muona akivuta fegi sasa ni tatrans alikuwa ame sasa amerudi nikamwangalia hivi nikamwambia unadhania ni wewe tu unaweza vuta hii hii hi, kitu <laughs> nikamwambia baba yangu alikuwa anavuta sigara pia na ni mimi nilikuwa na muashiaga kachukua sigara pia mimi nikahakisha mm. basi wacha tuchape wacha nikuje saidi yako mm. wacha ininyonge mm. wadau haikunisaidia <laughs> i when i came back that was the start of he knew there is nowhere i will go ah uh, utawaenda mahali he knew i will never go anywhere mm. mimba tukalea kuna time alienda job nikaachwa for like two months akaenda job ilikuwa set books watu walikuwa na travel so i was left in the house alone bla bla pale huruma eh pale huruma niko peke yangu kwa hako kanyumba unatokaga tu na jipea walk na nini na nini mm. time came to give up to give birth mm. i didn't have money mama najua sasa so, no i haven't told her i'm pregnant because the time she met me after nilimwambia sitakuja mom nime change mind ameni ame ame ameomba msamaha sana na hakuna hakuna ku apologize haku apologize haki Mungu mmoja mm. after giving birth kulikuwa na so many things ju tulikuwa tunafanya job pali pamoja jicho mm. so that means he can't travel and i can't travel we need to do shows at Kenya National Theater then the students come and we perform hiyo mm. time kulikuwa na dem flani walikuwa na act na yeye alikuwa unaona venye did you read the river the, the river between i did read the source oh god <laughs> oh lord there is a book where there is a lady and a man who they love each other but there is a oh, okay 
it's between two girls and a lady and a man. And a man. A man loves a certain lady, but this lady goes and gets circumcised and dies. So he picks the sister. So me, I was the one who was circumcised and died. Kwa, kwa, kwa acting. Mm. Alikuwa naitua Muthoni. Umu ingina alikuwa naitua Nyambura. So Nyambura, kind of they, they, they are now him. He was acting as the boyfriend. Okay. So every time wakiwa stage, ulajua umuona mke instincts as ikosangi kukuambia. Okay. Now, na feel kuna closeness flani na kamju wana act pamoja mara mob. There is something. There is something. Hey, ni kanza kushuku. Unajua bado wa, walikuwa na kakitu sababu ukisikia kitu dilishika hizo hizo alipkoliwa time haifai mm. nikasikia nikamuuliza unajua alikuwa leo dem kuniaibisha na si kusikia alimcall kumwambia naisa kwa hapa ujua uko loud speaker usikia alimweka loud ujua uko loud speaker naisa na nadhania tuko na mimi na wewe tuko na kitu huo dem akasema gai mimi <laughs> na nikaamini wadau Aki, na nikaamini hakuna kitu. Kumbe aliwoniwa eh alimwambia hivyo ndio mm, aste. Ameoniwa usionge. Na mimi sikuwa na hizo. Mimi nilikuwa kale I, I do not cheat. I do not cheat. Mm. When my daughter was nine months. Mm. So okay, how was it like the giving birth? The giving took birth, care of you. The giving birth was hard because mm. now mtoto came early. Seven and a half months and I mm. like yeah, eight months. Hata siku nimepiga hata picha hata moja nini ile siku nilianza kusikia stitch nika na nini nika call madhi hapo ndio nilimwambia mam niombe mm. naenda na feel vibaya niko na mimba kanambia i've been dreaming uko na mimba na nilikuuliza na ukusema the only person who knew was my brother but he never said anything because we are close ni siri yetu <laughs> i'm telling you siku ya kuzaa nikapelekwa kwa hosi fulani wakaniambia ati nimefunguka 3 cm ati so haiwezi go back nikamza hakuna venye mnaweza ifunga yani mtoi hakuna shida tunajua guy nikafika kwa nyumba unasikia ameniambia 3 cm so i need to go pick up staff niende hosi wakasema the nearest hospital ju mtoto anaweza come anytime ni pumwani mimi nilikuwa nimesema siwezi zalia pumwani tule to do 240 si nilitukula nikiwa na miba kwani nimebakisha kitu oi please hakuna mm. hosi kufika <laughs> do you know watu wenye wanajua hizo um, size za chai road na nini za pumwani kuna pali kuna itwa Saint Teresa Saint mm. Teresa unashukia anga ndio unachukua gari za kukuingisha pumwani mm. tulifika usiku hapo by saa hakuna magari yote makukuwa na mandudi So see you walk. Mm. Throughout me najua bag yenye imebeba kumbe nilibeba nguo zangu zote za mtoto zenye nishawahi buy. Unaona see you're supposed to go to the hospital with a bag that you've packed for 2 3 4 days. Mimi nilibeba nguo zangu zote za mtoto hizo zenye nilikuwa nimebuy. <laughs> Jusiko anajua hata unafaa kubeba nini. I didn't have anyone to tell me what I should expect. It was only one neighbor alikuwa na watoto saba. Kwa single room aliniambia, "Eh, hey, unasikia aje sasa wewe hata yako inakuja na damu." Wewe hata kupata mtoto utapata na damu. Utamwaga hiyo damu unaweza kufa. He, mimi trauma. Nimefika Saint Teresa na walk tu. Tukafika from Saint Teresa to Pumwani mguu. Kufika doka kanambia ingia, we uko karibu kupata mtoi. Siku hata na doya kulipa. Juu alikuwa job mimi nimeacha job sasa. Yeye alikuwa job. Nakumbuka mkubwa wa jichofo mwenye jichofo anaitwa Jasper Odak. Mm. Ali 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 alitusendia 4000 ya kulipa pumwani and then my cousin came through na za juju tulilipa 7500 for the days i was there and hiyo siku siku hata na daipa ya mtoto siku hata ni nilipewa na mtu hapo nifunge mtoto wangu kalikuwa kadogo 2.2 i don't know what to do with her i am 22 years old i don't know what to do with her it was like four days after my birthday because me in first june i gave birth fifth june And I'm telling you that I tell ladies please at your 20s please if you can't don't give birth usipate mimba your time enjoy kwa na time ya kujijua just know yes watu kwa sure huyu ni chali yako na mnapendana alafu mm. unatendwa but at least I think when you're 28 29 going to 30 ama 27 you're mature enough to take care of that child when you're alone mm. after giving birth I came back home. I didn't know how to wash the baby. My mom can't come in my house cuz it's one room. Atakawa wapi? Where is the boyfriend? 
the boyfriend is around okay. the boyfriend juu sasa si mimi nilianza kufanya kujipikia na kufua nguo za sasa tunapitwa enye alibai much later juu after nimepewa diaper alikuja akabai tu kuna wa mama uzungusha hizo napi yes, na una buy 70 bob ama 80 bob so my cousin venye alikuja kuniona hosi akaona zikizungushwa si akaninunulia pia baba mtoto akakuja na zingine tatu mm. eh, alikuwa there by the wakati wa kupata mtoto mimi siwezi sema he was not there he mm. was there he was there Nine months into after giving birth i remember my mom came after one week Mama yake alikam hiyo same same day came with a card na mandizi mama yake eh mama yake was the first time you seen her no i had seen her. ah mama yake tunajua tulikuwa tumejua nimelala kwao mara moja they have never gone to my place oh. kwao nilikuwa najulikana kwao hata guka ama show show they they loved me sister yani i was a constant visitor kwao okay. to an extent of uh, 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 I was a part of them yani ile kabisa 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 what they didn't have ni side yetu hawakuwai nini bodha hawakuwai bodha and after our baby was nine months i remember i went back to work set books now tulikuwa tuna act ya liberty hall pale ngara pale kuna itangwaje eh liberty hall iko chai road pale ga hiyo jina inapotea liberty hall baby ko wapi Pangani Pangani that's the, the 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 name ilikuwa Pangani I went back to work so you can't go back with a baby so sister ki akakam kukana sisi jua tu kwa hali ya nalala nilichukua manguo zenye hatutumi yangi nikachukua ki, ki bed sheet and then tukatengenezwa ikae kama mapillows so una staff hizo manguo si za nalalia hapo mchana si ataniangalilia mtoto so mimi nitaenda job na tulikuwa tuna work na baba mtoto same place so he 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 he, he, he is a singer So alienda pia shule ya usania kuimba. So ana act na bado anaimba. So ile time ana, ana, ana maybe sisi tunaanza ku act by 10 anaongea na mwenye shule anaenda hii shule sanaa. Sijui inaitwa sanaa school ya kufundishana kuimba. Eh, anaenda huko asubuhi maybe one hour before ndio akuje tu act sasa huko kwingine kwenye tunalipwa set books. So mimi haisikwa na, na thoughts that anything can happen. Mm. So akienda I think wakakuwa mabeshte na dem flani huko alikuwa anaitwa sita hii sababu hiyo jina Val. <laughs> Val Val alikuwa anaitana na Han na Hani. <laughs> Sasa siku moja Val mimi tuko kitchen tuko sistake yeye yako hapa tumekalia bed sistake amekalia kwa kitu tulikuwa tumepewa na neighbor hapo ameshika mtu hii naye ako nine months kamelala hapa kamelala hapa kametoka kulala afta kamenyonya so tunagoja kasapa kaive Val aka text unaona venye nyinyi uko mnaangalia kitu kwa simu alafu text la inapo mungu inapo mingi huyu mungu <laughs> ukimwomba atakusaidia <laughs> kaka pop up hi han you didn't come today what's up who be val ni nani huyu mnaitana han ti sisi uitana shule hivyo mm. tunaitananga hivyo han kila mtu naitanga mm. kila mtu han mm, kaambia usinibebe hivyo alafu nilikuwa nime develop since i didn't have friends after giving birth kuna ile ka place ni postpartum depression mm-hmm. where you lose all your friends i didn't have friends isipokuwa colleagues who are also very young like me they don't see the essence of a baby so they won't come to visit you with goodies for baby no them ni akipole amelia pole akimulilia atakutapewa si kama saa hizi unaweza saidiwa kubeba mtoto back then it was so i didn't have friends so that means all my thoughts if i'm troubled i if i talk to my mom i will stress my mom if i talk to their mother their mother will choose side their boy so i didn't have anyone is pokwa sistake sistake was a really good friend actually at a place ni yao sister ya ex hapa hapa duko yes i uh, yes <laughs> She was a very good friend away from me being who because she was younger than me and then she's a girl just like you, you know. Yeah. So she was really close to me so we could talk. Ile time had to engage you ni mles kuniliko. Ameniacha na miaka mob. Nimemwacha na miaka mob. So una feel kuna vitu wezi muambia ju pia huyu ni brother yake. So I used to write them down and then once nimesoma hiyo story nimelia yangu yote, yangu yote imenitoka airarua and then as itupa kwa dustbin hiyo kitu inanitoka that is how i used to deal with stress because you can't talk to anyone because my mom was was sick my mom ulcers my mom ukimu imemupeleka my friend that's a story for another day we 
Mimi hakuna kitu sijaona hivi. Hai. So tukade, hiyo siku nimemuuliza Val ni nani? Akaniambia hata wewe siku hizi naona unaandika andika mavitu. Si anajua kwenye book iko. Kumbe amekuwa akisoma na sijui amekuwa akisoma my thoughts. Yeah, sijui. Yes, haju, sijui. Mm. Kumbe so akasema aka hiyo siku. Hata wewe naona anga unaandika vitu. Ushainiona nikikuuliza ni nini hizo unaandika. Nikamuuliza kuandika ni different. Mbona huyo anakuita Han? Hapo na hapo akachukua aka penye na ikanga book juu nilikuwa naiweka. Unaona bed rather than kuchukua mattress uiweke chini kuna venye bed zingine ziko juu naweza wacha nitumie hatera kitabu <laughs> <laughs> unaweza kelea kitabu katikati hivi <laughs> na isionekane <laughs> so kumbe anajua hapo ndio mimi weka akatoa nikamwambia ni pebu yangu akapanda juu ya kitanda he was tall sasa mimi narukia hey kijana alinirusha unaona mlango mlango wa kuingia kaka kitu si tunaingishanga mkono unafungua nyumba yako zile nyumba zenye zina hard metal doors si unajua huruma kuna hizo si kuna hako kaka kitu kamefura na ndani alinirusha ikanigonga hapa kwanza nikakosa hey i think il, iliniumiza vibaya si kupata damu but ilifura so mimi kurudi nilimkuta i think ali, ali, ali tuli, tuli ali ni, hiyo kugongwa mimi sijui what happened sistake akaamka akamwambia bro wachana na yeye yeye naye akarusha sistake mtoto amelala akarusha sistake kwa wall akamrushanisha kulikuwa na kashel tumetengeneza pia kakagonga sistake hapa so sina any help sasa munaanza kushout kwa nyumba wacha nipigwe wo guy ndio kitu wo sita wai sahau hiyo si haikuwa slap yeah. alinipiga wo for six months i had a black eye six good months for for like a whole like eight months inside yangu ilikuwa imefura na ukienda job Niki, nikienda job sasa si unapakwa kuna dem fulani alikuwa anajua makeup alikuwa anaitwa standi so every time tukipiga show alikuwa nani alikuwa anakuuliza alikuwa alikuwa anani paka paka watu job niliwaambia nimeanguka kwa stairs mm. nikiwa nimebeba maji na mtungi ndio nikaanguka na side nikagongwa kwa uso and then huku kwa lips jo alikuwa anagonga gumi Maji unajiuma unapata zile ma, zinaitangwa clots huku mm. nikifanya hili huku kwa mbavu nilikuwa jumini mlaita nilikuwa manze na hizo blacks zenye uligongwa mateke juu alinichapa kama mwanaume mwenzake mm. ile ile wo i shouted no neighbor unajua tumesurroundiwa na wakisi wajaluo wanini name them so wakamba so you know how it is in african society when people are fighting it's rare it gets a gentleman to come and intervene or a good person who knows big people or grown up should not fight like that a woman and a wife should not fight mm. physical war inaweza huwa mtoto hapo analia sistaki anamshautia woi muache 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 nothing the following day tuko job mimi ni mai, kuna kitabu inaitwa nilikuwa na act kama maimuna wenye wanajua maimuna ni nani nilikuwa star kwa hiyo kitabu and i'm telling you nilikuwa na kichwa imefura macho imefura isa imefura lipu kukota niko na nini huku that's what the first time i told my mom the truth i told my mom the truth nikienda job juu i need the money you always hata your job i need the money backstage nikakuta wase wananiuliza nini ime happen namwambia nilianguka kwa stairs boy moja sema uongo alikuwa anaitwa diofil alikuwa mzee kutuliko sisi wote came and told me i'm not stupid tito amekuchapa sasa unajua umeficha venye alisema kilio kilianzia emotions Mm. Yani it is it was so painful that this is someone you love with the whole of your wow could they hurt you this much like i was so say mimi ni mkubwa mwili i was so small and then he was taller alinchapa kama mwanaume my mom akaambia brother yangu brother yangu amenifuata tumeachana na 2 years brother yangu hiyo time alikuwa amemaliza high school so ni ku hustle hapa pale brother yangu akaambia tu muende mimi ni mwangu kuliko huyo 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 baba Tasha atakipata sister yangu si wa kugongwa baba yangu hata hajawahi tugonga hivyo na hiyo time hakuna simu atutachukua vitu and then i was afraid to go to the police why would you why would you and then i've been simping all my life so he makes me feel like kunigonga hivyo it was my fault why why are you asking about val it's none of your business why 
Why should you have the audacity to ask? So he, ma he makes me feel like me asking about Val, it's the wrong way. And literally, I believed. When my mom was coming to see me, my mom saw Saizabeli yangu huku. Ningevunjika hata mbavu nikona ma black. Kabisa, si ushai gongwa na kitanda ama nini mm. na hujui, you find a ki black. Yeah. I had these on my blacks. Izo. Everywhere. Brother angu aliacho wa koja. Madhe alimuambia, siendi na eju mtaenda kuwana. Alimuacha koja, akakam. Do you know what my ex told my mom wakati mama alikuja kumuliza? Why hit her? Like, look at her. Mm. Uyu hata nikipeleka nyumbani, ya nakaadi. My mom cried. Na machozi ya limuambia mama yangu. Ati, ni kama hajui kukaa na mabibi na mabwana. Muongeleshe. <laughs> My mama kamuliza, are you talking to me like that? Aina noma. My mama hata kukaa two hours. Mamangu wakanembia park, tunaenda na mtoto. Unajua nilikata kupark. Nilimuambia, I still want to fight for this marriage. Mm -hmm. Yes. Juu, kitu ya kwanza ilini hit. Mam, nisha muambia. Ushago ni merudi. Unataka kuniambia yao maniba wote ni merudi na mtoto. Mimi niende nikakae na mamangu na nimejua kujihasulia. Apana nikaka. Sistake ana, ananiangalia hivya na shindwa. What the hell? Na ni mdogo wangu. What the hell? But nilika. I never went back home. I stayed with that guy to kahasu. Me I know how to hustle in this. If there is. Ata mabeshte. If I've ever worked with you. No me I work hard. Excuse me. Sorry. I work hard. So. Iyo time, Diofin, that guy talked to me and told me, you can love a person, but in Afikanga time, unamtoka, siku sikia. Siku sikia ki hivu, siku sikia. Nine years down the line, he didn't stop hitting me. Tukahama uko huruma, we went to somewhere in, 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 uh, kuna ito aje, kiambu, a one-bedroom house for the first time. Susa mshanza kupata dopoa. Tusha anza, juu pamoja, tumeingia sasa, tumetoka set books, tumeingia sasa hizi shows za watu wazima public shows zenye mm. sasa wase wana watch saa hizi za kina kama kina ni kwach ndenga hivyo we, 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 we now we, we started being like comedians za shows za kikuyu you create scripts and then you act so tuna work production moja most of the time you mm. see so tunaonana most of the time mm. ilifika time after kuhama i got a production called her strings and he, he constantly used to praise, it's good to praise other ladies, but I think you should know who to praise in front of your woman. Your, yeah. There was a show I had, I will never forget, and, and I invited him to see me on stage for the first time when Nilikuwa Nimepata Hastings, Kenya, a very big show. So it was my first, Nilikuwa Nimefurai, Nimezoya set books, watoto wa shule, ini grown-ups. So, Kambia, come watch. Do you know he came? So we solve it. Let's story. Eh, maisha siko, eh, maisha inaendelea and he blamed me. Me ndio nilikuwa na I apologize. Okay, Mimi ni wale wa nilikuwa na nil ni samehe. Ivo. Kai ivaki. Life changed and I'll tell you for a fact. Tu wanawake tulikuwa alikuwa na disrespect mbele ya wanawake, yes. Alikuwa na but I used to feel like bado hata ni blame ni mimi nilimfanya. Nikaingia anti boss nikakuwa famous. Iyo mm -hmm. ikaharibu kila kitu. You were telling us about, um, sorry for interrupting, mm -hmm. about his kume muita kuja one show. Yes, he came. Mm -hmm. He watched the show. I had a kwaka good character. Mm -hmm. And then, after leaving the show, tukirudi nikiwa kwa, tukiwa kwa mat, juu tunarudi home, so you will ask, he hasn't said anything about your performance, so you will ask him, how did you see the show? Nilikuita character angu liona aji. Because I know I'm good. I'm good at what I do. And even if you know whether I was good or not, come on, you should be sensitive. He said, yeah. he didn't talk about me anywhere. He said, hey, kuna uwa dem. Wacha nisimtaje jina, wacha tumpe jina na shiko. Kuna uwa dem, alikuwa na itua shiko. Hey, uwa dem, alikuwa na kutupua ni mrembo. He didn't say a thing about me. Nika swallow, nika nyamaza. Nikamuliza, oh, uyo tu ndiyo umemuona. Akaniambia, shoi likuwa kali, shoi likuwa kali, lakua udema, likuwa tu sawa, sana, 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 sana. Okay. We went home. Tukiwa home, tukiwa home, for some reason, I, I think me, eta siku wanasimu, tulikuwa tu, unaona venye unaombanga boy wako, nipea simi yako, sina credit. Nikienda kuchukua, nikakuta ame text huyo shiko. Ay, mm -hmm. Ati usiongele mambo yangu na isakiwa 
ni kama atakachi ude mshiko sijui hata wanajuana ni mimi nimeinto show imeisha venye show uisha una meet cast huyu anaitwa Eve anaitwa nani anaitwa Trevor anaitwa Letin nini nini hii ni cast yetu sijui ali exchange namba wapi unanishika mi kuona usiongelee mambo yangu na Isa Takach Udem tumeact na yeye. Udem ni bestie yangu sana. Udem wakati nilikuwa na kosa mafea, Udem alikuwa ananipea hata saa zingine. Mimi alikuwa ananii understand na niambia mimi niko single shika hii mimi yaenda home. Ananiambia hii nunulia mtoto chakula ya kukula. Udem alikuwa bestie yangu. All of a sudden kwa nini una asiongee mambo yako? Kwani what is really going on? Mimi Udem didn't tell me that she knew you were in a relationship yes, with yes, your Yes, 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 totally. Okay. Udem hakuniambia that ex wangu amemtext ati wasiongee mambo zake na hatukuwa iongelea ex wangu yeah. na uodim hatukuwa kufika job <laughs> tulikuwa backstage i will never forget tulikuwa backstage mm. me i have no idea udem hata hata udem ataniambia na nibishte yangu tukafika job kuingia stage ku act jioni usiku unaona si show audience imekaa mm. si mmeanza show siku na lines mna kuanga mume rehearse for a month or two kwa stage kukakuwa nikaa kumeongezea one scene ambayo mimi niko stage huyu dema kwa stage na watu wengine kama watatu machali wengine kama watatu mm. tuna scenario ya salon hii mushene zinakuanga kwa salon mm. so kulikuwa na mushene initially tume rehearse yenye tunafaa kupiga Mido. all of a sudden tumepiga hiyo mushene wame extend na eh shiko nasikia unatakwa na mabwana za wenyewe He? nasikia mpaka unaambiwa na mabwana za wenyewe usiongelee watu watasikia vibaya sawa machali ndio wanapiga hiyo story huyu dema kaingia hiyo story i don't know what to say because wameongeza like five minutes kwa stage sin sina and i totally know this is me they are talking about ajani kwa set yes audience imekaa mimi sasa mpaka ikafika time nimenyamaza sana nikarusha ka joke zile za ah Ukiona kijana anasema msiongelee basi hiyo ni kijana ako na vitu zake ni, ni vizuri kuji, kujihamu ni, 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 ni katoka stage si set meisha tumemaliza nini tukienda home niki change huo dem shikuwa kaniambia sweetie e, ni goje tuendanishe home nikamwambia haina noma i will never forget we were walking with jambi kwa ikai fire mama kwa mm-hmm. zilikuwa kwa show Faya mama tukafika penye nini pale kwa inange kwenye kuna unajua kwenye kumejaa wasichana wa, wa, wa usiku mm. <laughs> hiyo time yeye akaniambia anaenda job anaingia job jo walikuwa radio usiku so mimi nikagoja huyo dema hapo shiko shiko tumemuita shiko mm, aitu hivyo tumemuita aitu shiko kumit shiko shiko akaniambia eh hey, nice mbona bwana yako anani text au oh, alikwambia hii ndio text kambia nilinoti sata mmeniongelea stage was that the right thing to do nikamwambia mbona akute nikamuuliza mbona akutext mimi hata sijui mimi sijaiongea na yeye i respect people na umkanye hizi vitu ndio zinaharibia watu Vi? vitu huo ni best ananiambia so mimi best hana hatia nilishuka sita wai sahau watu kama wanajua Kiambu road kuna itwa place kuna itwa roe nilikuwa kaa kirigiti i walk to siku masaya saa sita crying from there telling god give me wisdom to handle this case i enter the house and i asked him mbona u text bani nini huyu dem mbona u text mbona u text shiko hivi ni nini nimekuarant u text hivi ju niliku ulimsifu nikakuuliza why umsifu kwa nini unafanya ni, niongelewe you should protect me from such gossip ju mimi ndio mniu kwa hiyo job au au madem watu walikuwa akina fa mama walikuwa amewak na hiyo production for long so i was the only newbie imagine you you are the newbie na ni wewe unaongelewa stage doesn't it makes you feel inferior yeah. bado na nyonyesha and he was like kama inakusumbua shauri yako he didn't care and there and there i was like hey me see he spend life na umsi kaambia sistake wacha ni save pesa tuhame hata kama nika bed sitter in the process of akuhama bed sitter sijui what happened we talked and then your case ikaisha i didn't go tukahama hapo tukaenda place kunaitwa wangige mudhore we found a two bedroom tulikuwa tulipa 8k sita waisa hao kadogo hapo <laughs> nikaanza for some reason nika, nikakuwa anti boss sasa you know when you enter tv kuna tudo ume, umepata 
na huko unazoea na bado nilikuwa bado theaters mm. i didn't stop acting in theater mm. i didn't i didn't stop acting in, in kwa tv so nilikuwa na juggle nilikuwa na do both jobs so that means twice income nikaanza kuongeza ka weight yeye pia alikuwa na majobs zake every single time hii hii si, sitasema juu na involve pesa nasemanga si vizuri ku trash especially pesa mm. wakati kama ni wewe you are taking of bills it doesn't matter because kama mulielewana you take care of bills it's okay you never trash any but whether mmeatana ama nini sababu ya pesa but this is zingine domestic violence or anything you should talk about pesa whether you as a woman you are taking care of nini so him he had very good jobs sometimes anapata jobs na mlipapua yeye yeah, yeah, ali focus sana kuongeza mwili yake kutekizi ma proteins nini za kuongeza muscle gym nini nini and it truly really came through because he was really a slender guy so bills zingine zinanikalia na saidi yake bado wanaendelea kungaa na kaa vizuri of course sita 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 pia mimi nilikuwa naongeza ka weight juu manzejo umeingia anti boss to do tumeanza kunga i didn't have a problem So Jim started becoming like one of the things I should now start going cause poti imeanza kukaa na staki mimi mm. napenda na, napenda venye unakaa you know napenda kukaa poa hata kama watu hatujabarikiwa please usikuwe na nini huku mimi napenda ku workout so tukaingia yeye akalipa gym akajilipia gym mimi sikuwa na do ya gym so i opted kufanyanga tizi huko masaya 6 7 home nafanya tizi za home cause you can watch them either kwa yeah, simu ya yeah, home workout so i decided to be doing that because our sitting room was so small hakuna pahali it either nitoe kiti moja nje <laughs> so the only thing ni tu nyumba tenye tulikuwa tunakaa tumeangaliana hii ni pathway nyumba za watu ziko hii size za watu ziko hii size hakuna yenye iko upstairs so it's either uweke kwa hiyo concrete kitu ya kuwakia hapo ama uende nyuma ya nyumba kulikuwa na nyasi ka, ka field kadogo mm-hmm. na then landlady wamejenga hapo bwana yake alikuwa anafanya watu ni mzee ni wale wazee 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 wa ngombe na nini na nini so nika nika opt nyuma juu ni ku soft kuliko mm-hmm. concrete siku moja mimi sijui ni mashetani gani zimemuingia ame come home ametoka gym amenikuta mimi niki nikifanya sit up zangu na hapo nyuma ame kama kaniambia ingia kwa nyumba nikamwambia mbona niingie kwa nyumba ati ati ore kiratizi hao ratura mira mwene musie <laughs> niko zile za azil <laughs> the owner of this cage akini <laughs> niguka yangu <laughs> ana do tour company that That is disrespectful. Nimeva nini trouser za ku workout. Mm. I've been working out here, you know. It's not the first time neither the second time. You know you have to ask questions, you know. Pia wanawake tuachange toka hapa na unatoka na unaenda na ujauliza. And then in the process of kumuliza ni nini, si nimekaa, si umetoka kufanya sit up hivi. Si umekaa chini kwa grao hivi. Nilikuwa na braids he pulled he pulled so in the process of pull sinita simama kidogo and then aka akanifanya kichwa akanifanya kichwa hivi so nikaland chini kwa kwa nini hapa Nili, nilikuwa na na hizo ni kama ni, ni, nyasi imekugwara mimi kwa mka nikamuuliza mbona unanigonga nini 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 guy ukajamu nilichapwa neighbor flani nzito hizo walikuwa naitwa mama Mary came through kaambia hapana utamgonga hivyo mama Mary was sick na time alikuwa na stroke but alikuwa na pona pona <coughs> Sorry. When she came through, alimrusha. Alirusha huyo mama. Mwade wa wenyewe. Eh, na si mama myang, ni mama ako na sang older than ex wangu. Huo mama akasonga kando. Tukienda kuingia, nika ni alikuwa naenda kunifungia nilale nje. Juu already sasa giza si saa moja imeingia, giza imeanza kuingia. Na akifunga hiyo mlango trust you me, hata afadhali asisulie bako hata nifungulia keja hata nifungulie nitashinda hapo nje sina anything sina sweater sina any do na niko sure hata nipea sina simu so that means hakuna nitalala hapo aniibishe nitalala hapo so in the process ya kunigonga nisiingie kwa nyumba akashika si ni mlango alishika mlango hivi mimi niko nje alikuwa amevaa ka sweater nikashika ka sweater hivi in the process ya kunichapa ana ananipush nisiingie kwa nyumba So alishika mlango hivi so he's pushing me na mateke ameshika hivi ana, mpaka nagonga hapa ka hivyo urudi 
ukirudi nika nika grasp shati hiyo ka sweater alikuwa na utu tu sweater tu na ni inakushika mwili nilishikia hapa nikakwama nayo kukwama nayo si nilimvuruta in the process ya kumvuta hiyo sweater ilidaruka yote in the junior siku ya chilia jo alikuwa anataka kunifungia nje na mtoto wako ndani na i know it would have devastated our daughter it would have made her cry the whole night and it him hakei and for some reason venye nilirarua neighbor fulani akasikia ikakuwa ikakuwa too much noise even for him akaenda na akaingia side ya bedroom na akafunga i just went mtu yeye alikuwa dango da melala picked her picked my house up nikamboya chukua suitcase yako called my mom i'm done for the first time i left that was after how long that was after like um 2011 2012 2013 2014 now that was 2014 towards the end like four years yes nikatoka nikabeba nikawaambia mam tunaka mtu kafika kwa mam saa tatu jumtoi wangu alikuwa na shida ya kifua alikuwa asthmatic back then kifua ikafungana sana usiku na hakuna usiku karibu my mom was like huku limuru si unajua limuru kuna baridi baridi imezidi so you can't stay here acha niongee na kazini yako au moyo uende ukae huko for some as we resolve this nimepigwa ile propa bado niko na hizo 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 blisters na nini kazini yangu kuniona analia ananiambia nice ni na venye wewe ni mrembo venye wewe ni mtoto mmoja hata kushinda kama bado you still take care of yourself right now and you're still learning you can still get a customer you can go back home and and or stay here ukuje na msichana wa kazi angalie tasha kidogo kidogo unaona two days hazikuisha kama niko kwa kazi yangu ukarudi akaanza kuni text i will replace you hata nanaleta mwingine nini 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 he hapo na hapo one my cousin akaniambia ukiona akiongea hivyo ni kama ako na mtu mwingine mimi naweza sema usitupe hivyo ndio iko family tunaambiwa turudi kwenye umechapo aliniambia nirudi tu ni secure my marriage and do you know that's what i did i went back my mom came the following day to talk about it he didn't even give he, her an audience alisema yeye hata ongelea ujinga and my mom came stayed never slept and i didn't go back home my mom tried come back come back i didn't so mom was again in mm. and from there i think 20 now 15 ni nisiongee sana 2015 that's when now cheating became too much he joined a different dini production Election. and he would not hide it he is not her coming home two three four days so nikamuliza siku moja nika sasa ikaanza kuni get into me ile ya ni kubaya depression ikanigonga hivi ndoka antibots gonga eh niko antibots nimekonda niko ikan it's no it's 2015 towards uh, sep september stress ikanigonga umse ana cheat back to back na umse mpaka ha- haogopi akiweka picha facebook akasema it was taken by someone i love na simu yenye inatekiwa picha na huyo demo huyo demo alikuwa mrich alikuwa older than him she had a car she had a family apparently alikuwa separation na hazi yake na alikuwa na mtu mkubwa you know so sijika ni pesa aliona ama ni nini hey ngori ika, ikavuka siku moja nikamgoja after like a day hakukuja kama jana the following day nikampigia simu kama unakuja home leo eh nikamgoja kumgoja hiyo day nikamuuliza ni nini kunaendelea mbona ukujangi una behave hivi aliniambia mimi niko na mtu mwingine na ya no longer feel you if nilimnilia down na kuomba usiniache sijui hiyo hiyo roho inatoka wapi umechapwa na bado husiki na kuomba please 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 aki nini nini tupendane tu eh oh yeah to see to pay marriage hapo una katoto ketu we just start na jo ni pesa umeona maybe tutatengeneza pesa mob na kuomba tutatengeneza we can do this nini nini nikamnia nikamshika mguu alinifanya hivi unaona venye yeko and from there suicide thoughts started coming tried kujigongesha gari hii wangige road inasemekana wakipita wa nikijileta mbe hatupui 
nikajaribu kuna kabarabara ka kwetu our house was the last house so hakuna barabara ingevuka na kulikuwa na tu nini hostels tenye hao watu wa shule walikuwa nakuja so tu, kulikuwa kuna kujua na youngsters usiku wa manane wanaletwa na cab na hiyo njia yetu ilikuwa na manyasi so nilienda nikalala kwa hiyo njia ndio gari ikikuja juu kuna nyasi haita niona so itakuja kama imeni pitia juu imenipitia juu hey ivu wacha nilale hapo wana wa second hour isipokuwa baridi ilinigonga hakuna gari ilikuja for 3 hours haikuna ilikata kunimaliza 2 days later nikachukua kisu nikienda kujidunga for the first time my daughter aliamka kuitisha poti for the first alikuwa analala na diaper mchana hana diaper anatumia poti usiku kanalala the whole night so unamfunga in case asusu nilikuwa mpaka hata na recycle hiyo diaper moja juu kama hajaisusulia si unaiweka ya kesho juu ilikuwa tu moja ya kulala usiku for the first time mama shushu alinikuta na kisu kwa nishara rua kitroza nilikuwa nimevaa eh hata sometimes inakuanga na kalai na hapa hmm? mm. kenye 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 nini eh nilikuwa nisha you know nilimuona shushu nikaachilia kisu and i looked at her and i'm like shame on you nice you want to leave her because of him no and i picked myself up and from there aka cheat venya na cheat nini nini aka cheat hiyo september alikuwa ame cheat before september kujangi home saa zingine ana stories zinanifikia huko nje zile zile zenye mtu anakuja a, 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 anasema vile mi niko chini hakuna kitu najua ni so si zinanifikia esteem hauna nini hauna November shoshi yangu mwenye amenilea akapas. Nikamwambia asijaribu kukuja mazishi jua tuko in good times. Aki 3 months later mama ka manyuri ya pia. Niambie hiyo ilikuwa imenifunga hivi. Sasa by the time shoshi alipas nika feel enough is enough like iha o jua alikuwa anakuja akikuja bado ananikahama bedroom nikaenda bedroom ya mtoi juu singe afford kuhama hiyo keja siku na do na alikuwa anaenda 5 days alafu anakuja bedroom isingiwe na mtu atalala huko nikahama bedroom kabisa unajua li, alikuwa alikuja mm. later mimi nikaamua nikapata ni to nikihama hakujua hakujua nilihama alijua after 5 days nimehama imagine mm-hmm. na alikuwa before that ameniambia like a week need to change i want us to build something pole nimekutesa i realize my family is important ni 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 kama anataka hajui nisha make up my mind nataka oh. kutoka but the time he was making up mind you it was very late it was very late for me so one week nisha nika 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 hata kan mefua nguo mimi nimefua zake za ndani ambazo unakuta ziko na ma lipsticks unajua alikuwa wapi but because you want your family back I've brought up in a family na hiyo kusimp sip kwa wanawake it's good i didn't love myself let me just say i didn't love myself that why that's why i tell young girls stop giving back when you're so young because you tend to take care of another child so your life goes on haka katoto you forget yourself you don't love yourself you don't know what you're worth you don't know and i was still in antibos nakumbuka mdosi wa antibos akinipiga lecture nice i'm begging you start a life alone she al- karibu atoe machozi lusi mwangi akiniambia no 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 if it is me getting you out of that house i will get you out of that house nikahama kwa one bedroom alijua alikuja jioni si nyumba haiko na giza kaingisha mkono akasikia kickfuli akanicall nikamdanganya niko kwa kuzo akaanua boxa nilifua akaeka kwa bag akaenda kwa huyo mtu mwingine 5 days alijua ana friday alienda friday akarudi the, the other day or the other week on a friday yani mumeniwacha yani hata siamini na kuja kwa nyumba na kuja mumeenda mumeniwacha kaambia mimi nilishamku tushamalizana tushamaliza sasa hataki uende acha asumbue mama yangu wacha asumbue mama yangu mama yangu mpaka ananiambia eh hey, modoe wako ta please nie de de code de toro ginyale gera huradha akeda nie de code de toro kaambia mama msimpikie simu tena just don't pick ana call na numbers different na ujue sina akili wakati for the first time my mom came to visit me in my own house tukaka tukaka i was not for him i didn't date anyone when i was in separation come the next year january my mom got got sick ile sana so tunampeleka husi hapa pale feb akapumzika 
kupumzika the guy came so back. your mom used to get maybe other diseases because of the yes 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 because yes. your immune is so low yeah because of the age yes it was so low two weeks as in end up eve kama aja kuwa na ka emergency flan jupi mm. alikuwa na zile acute ulcers so if anything stresses her there is rvs there are rvs na hizi madawa zingine and then she was weak yani it was a lot but we we maneuvered there was still love a lot of love between me my mother and my siblings mm. we were together ki ile kitu poa but wakati if my mom passed that guy came he even he, he even got late kwa kwa nini kwa ni kweli tu kwa pamoja but he even got late. he became he, he started becoming close to me sasa ameanza ku kuni kuninyemelea tena throughout mazishi mabeshti wangu wenye wako close wanakuja kunishika na watoa at the end ya nishikilie huwezi muambie juu hataki kuibika it's it's nazika mama yangu it's alichelewa mochari alikuja late guess what alikuja na huyo mama na sikujua imagine barrio ya mama yangu aliendesha hiyo gari ya huo mama wakakaa na akashinda amenishikilia <laughs> wajeri ya karia of course vulnerability will bring me back hata hii sikumaliza 2 months tu doto yenye nilikuwa nime, nimepewa 2 shillings 5 nini pale pale si as a first born kuna tu do brother yangu nikamtransferisha shule pesa ikaisha sasa ni mimi working hard for me Lucy Mwangi akanitafutia advert for some reason Three, four days after my mom was buried nikapata advert ilikuwa ya ya kujisajili hizi voting cards so mm. they paid me well hiyo don ka use kuhama guess what nilihama tuhame pamoja si nilitoka kwa haka kanyumba yeye akatoka ile nyumba nilimwacha tukamit nyumba ingine tukae pamoja sasa tumerudiana mm. kurudiana tukampaka celebrate now five years seven years now have clicked by the time mom is going seven mm. years have clicked mm. pasi akakaa makatuombea kwa hiyo nyumba tulikuwa <laughs> nini nini i'm still vulnerable mwaka ya kwanza tukahama tena hiyo kija tukaenda a big house three bedroom house it was a nice house at some point because my brother didn't have anywhere to go because now hatuna dada tuna mama tuna shosho tuna guka na ako high school i met her from to so i'm there mom bro aka come sinona nime transferisha nimempeleka boarding school because he was in a day school mm. iliuma sana sababu he told me for how long are we going to stay with this your brother ataka huku nikamwambia akifunga shule una expect aende wapi am saizi ananiangalia kama mama yake huu ni mtoto wako ako 15 yeah, years we are orphans He told me he will not stay with us in Tafutia Mahali. Nikamwambia for the first time I stood up for myself nikamwambia it's either him or you. Akaondokea. Hakuwai pea brother yangu hata 50 bob. Ya wewe ni brother yangu ndio shika hii ununue toothpaste. It was all me. All me and then brother yake came to stay with us. Brother yake sasa alikuwa sasa ashaingia kole mm. i didn't have a problem cuz brother ke was close to me and he's, he's a good person i give chances to people and that time i was better better in terms of to pesa twenye tunaingia hapa pale na act hapa unapata to jobs to advert hapa pale so mimi najuanga kujipanga and then there was some friends of my mom mwenye alikuwa majua alikuwa ananisaidia saa zingine ku ananitumia 15k na lipa shule ya bro specific ni ya brother yangu mm. 15k saa sa zingine na send saa zingine akikosa my uncle mmoja wanatafuta basari ya 5k so nilikuwa nasaidika na uto to do so from shopping nini nini it's me na hawezi pea huyo mtoto hata 5 bob hivi hata 5 bob mimi brother yake hata za ndani ni mimi nilikuwa nanunua yeye ni wale wa if you need to do something if i need to give you even a shirt i don't wear you have to do something for me Like kama unakaa I believe in kama unakaa kwangu it's your responsibility kama nje ni chafu fagia tu my brother was that brother ke pia hakuko ikuwa kuchafu unaona but he will insist of doing other dirty jobs zenye zinawa fanya wa feel some type of way some type of way because kuna kitu anawapea na wanakaa kwake and, and and I used to feel it's not fair 
So to cut the long story short, 2018, May, there was a show at Kenya National Theatre. And uh, mostly, kulikuwa kuna different productions. So kuna production jichofo na ingine ilikuwa. Yo yenye ilikuwa, kulikuwa wana stage show. Na naturally, creativity huku inje kama ni creative if it is necessary for you to watch other people's things so that you don't yeah. copy them or you don't think the same thing mm. or you don't present the same thing, right? So we usually watch other people's shows ndiyo msiweke lines kwa show yenyu zenye wameweka. So me I went and watched the show. Nikiwa kwa show, jutulienda watu wengi, it was on a Wednesday, I will never forget. Either Wednesday, yes. My friends, unasikia tuko cast moja, waka, wako zile za, eh, nice. Sileo mzai waka na host kre, nini, karaoke, kule dhome, eh. Si tukimaliza hapa, tuende sisi wote. Mbogi wa kama saba. Unajua hiyo ni katikati ya month kumakuanga kumekauka kwa club za kunanga watu. So mimi nikajua, ah, hata kama nilikuwa nimemwambia siendi kariuki juu nimechoka kesho yake ndio nilikuwa naanza show at pale Alliance Fonse. So that means you need to sleep early and actually wake up rejuvenated because you're staging a show from tomorrow. Mm. Unaona? Kwenda karaoke. Nick akaniona wacha afure. <laughs> mimi nashindwa na fura. Tu, tumeshinda poa. Ananiambia unakuja unafanya nini huku? Nikamwambia eh cuz I always attend hizo karaoke nilikuwa mpaka natokea kwa posters it's not something new I go every week so why not today you, you, you're getting kitu you are accustomed to when I never there's no any day at nipe ruhusa nikuje karaoke yako no so many times nilikuwa na kwa kwa poster kuvuta audience cuz I was still yeah. a name watu wakikuja wanakuja kuni meet as the karaoke na nia atalipwa mimi si siingilia hapo mimi hata kupewa pombe ya free hiyo time siku hata napewa ni ile tu you're supposed to in your person mm. i miss juu ni nini ilifanyika usiku akamaliza show yake and then meza yenye tulikuwa tumekaa na mabeshte si mabeshte wakaenda home mimi nikaachwa kwa meza na ni mabeshte anajua wamewak pamoja si ati ni watu ni, ni venye umeacha hiyo job lakini nyinyi bado ni mabeso ni watu wanajua na aliko, he was very happy because all of them are seeing us mm. na they came and spent money so yeye yeah, anafeel like of fit watu audience imekam meza ilikuwa nyuma kulikuwa na chali na madem wawili after my meza kwenda na amemaliza job mm. he stood he came rather than sitting with me came and told me anaka anataka kwenda hiyo meza ingine kumbe huyu chali amemletea dem oh, yeah. na mimi sijui so mimi kuka kuwa mabeshti wengine wameingia na anawajua nikamwambia eh hey, mimi nimeboeka nikamwambia kidogo nazaenda pale nipige na wale story juu naona bado wewe hujamalize eh enda 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 nikaenda meza ingine pale kwa counter kwenda kwa counter beshti yangu amekaa like t- last week tumefanyia huyo beshti yetu ni beshti ana- wanapendana hmm. hawananga beef huyo beshti yetu wife yake amekuwa na bash hmm. so ni sisi tuli host See, then that means you're close hmm. Uyu beshte yetu mwenye li, alifanyia wife yake bash, amekuja na kidem. So mi namuliza, eh hey, bana, hizi ni gani? Uwezi leta dem mwingine kwa club na tumetoka kufanyia wife yako. At least wife yake anajulikana hapo. Mm. At least mpe hiyo hesh. Makanambia ya huyu ni kazini yangu. We na huyu napenda kujaji, huyu ni kazini yangu. Nikambia, ah sasa kuzo pole. Nilikuwa nime muingilia mimi ni wale. I call people as it is. Nikikuta Trevor na mutu mwingine. Ah ah, ako hapi hivu. If ni aje, we will rectify this nation. <laughs> Ndugu yangu, mi sijui ilifu, akamaliza, wale mabeshte wakaenda. I think haka jam juu, maybe ya kuenda na huyo dame, ama nimekuja, nimemtua timing. Niliharibu. Haka kuja penye niko. Nikiwa, kabla fike kwenye niko, tunaongea na huu uh, beshte yake na huu kuzo mwenye nime introduce wa kuzo. Kabla fike, huyu kuzo, haka muona, haka wana ex wangu pale kwa ile meza akasema hii ule boy yako na dread ni nani ni msupu huyu beshte yangu akacheka sema <laughs> ni bwana ya huyu <laughs> nikamwambia ni msupu eh hey, kitu poa ni kitu poa ati siwende umwambie nimemsalimia nikamwambia really unanituma kwa ule bwana yangu nimsalimie umemsalimia Ay, that is not fair <laughs> nikamwambia in, in fact fanya hivi wacha akikuja hapa umsalimie tu juu Haina haja mi niende na hata jileta tu hapa. Siku kata 3 minutes akajileta. Nikamwambia ndio huyu. Nikamwambia we nani ana unasalimiwa hapa? Na Dema kamsalimia ni aje. Eh, lakini nyinyi machali wa supu hamnanga. Muna mnajisikianga sana. Mimi I think hiyo ikamkwaza. U Dem kumwambia nyinyi machali wa supu hamsalimikagi. Mimi sijui ilimkwazia nini. 
Hey, akatukana uo dema jina no 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 no. <laughs> za makahaba, malaya. Alafu saa zinye host. Na anasha utu watu wakaanza kuangalia round. What happening? What happening? Alafu ye ni host. Automatically mimi, ai bana, utai, hii hi ni kazi yako bana. Na mimi pia ni public figure. Ni kamfanya hivi. Utachoma. Kata, kata. Juu dema melewa. So wewe umemtukana malaya. Yeye pia dema amewaka. Mm. Kwenda huko ushawahi sijui lala na nani. Ushawahi nikuta na mama eh ime, imeanza kukua. <sighs> na mimi hizo tu sisi sijui sijui. Uh, uh. Sasa huyu beshte yetu alamwambia huyu dem wewe tulia bana ilikuwa joke na mimi na mimi natuliza huyu huyu jupia mm. ameenda insensitive. Ti hata kitu yako imepanuka niko. Na wewe ni host yawa. Ni gani zinaendelea hapa? Niko Beb, tulia, tulia, tulia. Unachoma. Unachoma. Aski, aka, aka, ananigonga mkono. Yes, Niki mlevi. I think alikuwa mekunyua. Oh. Ananigonga mkono. Niki mbia, beb, unaona? <laughs> hey, mimi, ni, nikaona sasa mkono inaumia. Juu, naenda kuguza tu, naambi wata. Ubeshte huwa kaniambia, huyu, huyu kazi nangu hata nyamaza. Na mine kawambia, venye inaenda hata huyu hata nyamaza. Kaniambia, <laughs> wateke toma tigei. Mare kia koro wale, mare kia kuruma nare, watarudi. Tuwaacha watu kanane, wakimaliza, they will give each other heshima, tusiingilie ikesi. Unaona, mi ni mekatazwa, yeye, yeye ni kimkataza kusha uta haski. Uyu na yake ambia kazini yake wata haski. Guess what? Wakati huyu ya meniambia tuwaacha wapigane na maneno, mimi ni kagota beshta ni kawambia wazi. Unaona hii wazi? By the time nilikuwa narudi, nilikuwa na ngumi ya mdomo. Ameka hii ni counter. So hii ni counter, mzaya meingia mpaka ndani ya na attack dema kwa outside the counter. So wanatukanana, wame, the, the only barrier ni katikati yao ni counter. Mi ni konje ya counter. So wanarushiana maneno. Wanarushiana maneno. So hii ngumi ilikuja, hii ni counter na inje. Nimekalia sinatabu. Ili ni gonga na nikona dress ikaniangusha. Kuniangusha ni kamuka, ni kamuliza ni nini. Sasa mimi kumuliza ni nini. I don't know what happened. There was a drink kwa meza, kwa, kwa yu sinatabu, I mean kwa yu counter. I don't know ali break and then aka, aka shred. Hata hapa na kuanga na nini. Hapa, siju kama unayona. Mkona alama. Unaona yu alama, haka nikata. Kunikata, da, nani, flown ya white. Wacha, sunajua forehead really uses blood so quickly. Hata kwa gongo umie tu forehead. Forehead ina bleeding so quickly. Chua, sasa mimi, I didn't know ni forehead. Jue ile ngumi, na onadamu uso, Mdani na isha mdomo. nini nathania, ni, ni, na, na nose bleed. So throughout, niko hapa kwa nose bleeding. Ngwenye nilikuwa nayo, imepata damu na nini. Uyu beshte, niko na ye, wata nisimtaja jupia ni public figure. Aka inuka na muambia, guy, unagonga mtu amekuzalia wewe juu ya malaya. Uyu kazi ni yangu ni malaya. Ame, ame kufanyia. U, Na hii sata haja bonga. Hame kuambia tu wache kushout. What is really going on? Sasa mimi, na, 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 unaona niko, nimeamuka, nimekatwa, na bleed. Nini wakanza sasa wao zile za ananiulizia. Ju, he, he didn't stop. After cutting me, he didn't stop. He pulled my hair because I had dreadlocks. Haka niangusha chini. Mateke, haka anza kunivuta na nywele yangu. Na nywele yangu. Sasa hapo ye, haka ona ninoma, haka ingilia. Waka chapana. Uku like... A week later, uwa beshte yangu alikuwa na maalama. They had kuseparitua na mawoji. Nini, watu wa counter, wana shout, Ana bleed forehead, ana bleed, ana bleed, kwa zilikuwa ka deep cut. Ana bleed, ana bleed. Nini, leteni vodo, nikashikwa hivi. Sasa ni mwagiliwe, yache. Yache ku bleed. And the only thing he told the DJ wa your place ni. Huyu hata sita enda na yeye nyumbani. Huyu mwenye me kuulizia ni kikuchapa. Enda uolewe na yeye. Na he, na, thank God a woman doesn't never, as a woman don't walk without cash in your pocket. At least I had some money. It was 3 a.m. in the morning. Where would I have gone? See hotel wame kutetea. Na anafanya job huko. See hotel wame kutetea mpaka wana kupaka sijui nini wacha kubleed. Basi wakupe room ya kulala. Siendi na wewe home. Ametoka kulipua. So mimi nikona tudo kwa, kwa, kwa nika, nika call bishte yangu. Na hitu wa Josie, my best friend till now. Nika call. Nika mwambia, hi mama. Alikuwa metoka kuhama like a few days before. Kwako ni wapi ya kaniambia kahawa. Niko dhome, hiyo place inaitua Eden, Eden Bliss ama Paradise Lost. Ama Paradise, not Paradise Lost, Paradise something. 
and then my, my, my friend sent me a cab. With all the blood nilikuwa nayo, the only thing he also said, aliambia DJ. Munapenda huyu mschana. Mimi ndiyo mulipea kazi ya kuhost karioki hapa, lakini ya kikuja mshinde ya mkimsifu ni kama niya na host. Mimi nimejenga hii karioki kutoka zero, lakini ya kikuja muna shindanga mkisema ni kama niya mejaza watu hapa. Eh? Hata mimi ni mtu. So me, I didn't get it. I think it was the napata more fame, na more, the, I, I, more attention. More attention. From there, for a week, I didn't go home. I talked to, I had a very good house help. Na my bro, at least, alikuwa mefunga shule. So, ni kawawawawangelesha. I didn't tell my bro what was happening. Because my bro, uyu mdogo pia si mchache. Takama alikuwa high school kulikuwa kubaya. Now, 2018. And from there, when I went back, I still went back. <laughs> eh, I went back this time. I didn't call anyone to intervene. Nilichapa show na bandage. I think I have even a photo. I will send you that photo. Nikiwa nime, nime nini. Iyo show, nikianza, actually, the, nime chapwa iyo time nikona bandage, nime enda hosi, beshti yangu wame nipeleka hosi, wakanembi hawata nishona, juu itabaki ya lama kubwa. So, ni itekiekea, everyday na do, the nurse, nikambia wasinieke ile bandage ya white tube. So, alarming, waeke nini na to elastoplast mm. to kadha ikae ni kama ni carboil mm. so hiyo day morning ndio ilikuwa first meeting yenye tulikuwa tuna meet na wadosi wa idagariene kupewa characters i went with that everyone when you waliniona waliniuliza what happened nawaambia mimi nilikuwa haki kuju kulikuwa kuna drizzle drizzle niliteleza dirisha nilikuwa naosha chini ya nini nikiamka dirisha ikaniguza and they believed Wenye wako believe ni wenye wa show juu tulikuwa nao jana. Kwenda show manze niliact mpaka uwezi sema ni mtu amechapwa jana usiku. I mean niliingia stage na nikayusi hiyo kidonda kama fan. Nikasema he tuliingia kwa bau saba msa nikamtukana akanigoga na chuma. Dio hii matokeo. Sasa si audience will laugh because you're talking in Kikuyu it's a comedy. Yeah, it's funny in Kikuyu. So, hiyo kidonda isipokuwa another friend of mine called Magi, huyu nyambui the gariene who knew and that was her first show. I trusted her that she was the only one who knew what happened. Na nilikuwa nime meet hiyo time. Because wale wengine walikuwa mabishu. Walikuwa mechoka sana. Nikiwa peanga story ni mechapu. Mm. Unaona sasa for her. When I told her. Kaniambia sweetheart. It's the high time you choose yourself. When I went back. We sat down and talked. Me and him. Nikamuambia the next time you will hit me. I will walk out of that gate. So love imeanza kukuwa stale. Imeanza kukuwa too much. I'm giving too much. I'm, I'm allowing him to do too much. To me, I don't have esteem. I, I, I have suffered. That was 2018. And then I get, got nominated. AMVCA. When I got nominated, you already nikuwa nisha toka anti-boss. Si kupoa support na watu anti-boss mimi. Regarding voting. They didn't give me even one support. It was all fans fans voted and I'm thankful to God. You God now Ali Aliona I'm so broken that he lifted me up when I needed the help. And when I went and won if hey hey I think it hit me so different cuz he didn't even take me to the airport. He mpaka nimesikia kulia. he didn't take me to the airport. I am the one who talked to the friends. You know, friends wani wani nini wani 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 peleke. When they took me, I remember he 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 was still hosting karaoke, and friends wake. A friend took a picture of him, even saying, "Ah, baby, I'm talking about saizi wata sasa tujitawale na watu." Manze ni me ni it's 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 a moment for me when I won. It is when I think God came through. Akaniambia, you know what? You've been carrying yourself so low. I wish you can see yourself the way other people see you. And I chose myself for the first time. And after choosing myself for the first time, um, <laughs> after choosing myself for the first time, it's when I think nilianza kujipenda as a person. It's it's emotional. Maybe ni sababu ni kona mimba. Maybe. Maybe ni sababu ni kona mimba. Okay. Ni sababu ni kona mimba. We get so emotional. And when I came back, I looked at my daughter differently. I looked at her like a grown up me. 
why do you have to take all this bullshit you're a lady what am i teaching you what am i teaching you i didn't tell him that i've i've, I've chosen myself anymore i didn't tell him and we were still together kwa airport alinikujia alinikujia airport and he behaved he was so happy na kumbuka hiyo time siku hata na doya kutengeneza kucha nikienda naija hata ya nyuele and he had money he had he had three karaoke that he was paid he only gave me 2k nikitoka Kenya at in case nipate kitu nisiende because i didn't have even a dime because then the ndio ni travel usiku si leo ndio naenda Niger jana yake nilikuwa na karaoke nimeitiwa Muranga i travel all the way to Muranga alone na matatu nikamaliza came back to Nairobi to do tonya nimean made my nails and my hair a, a friend of mine because i didn't have nice dresses to wear huko akanisaidia him he gave me 2k it was painful because it was the highlight of my life i've supported him from karaoke people can testify that i i attended his karaoke i i was there when he needed help but for me for some reason i even talked good about himself that he got a job and boss for 10 episodes and pia huko aliniaibisha kuna demo walikuwa naishi na na nini na yeye to an extent of dosi aliniambia eh bana a a kwani huyu hakuheshimu you getting me So after after that after that I remember 2018 after now I won MVCA came back home started still acting hapa pale nimetoka anti boss imeandikwa huko nje he went for an event somewhere he didn't come home and we had talked anakuja mhumu mapema and told me ni silale you get I just had na kia get called him a couple of times and he told me he's on his way at amechukua kaba kwa sijui ile murwe anakuja at around midnight and ashaingia kaba na kuja home ikafika venye mtu doz off nikakuta it's 3 am na hajafika i got panic attacks zile za maybe accident imemwapenia because kwenye yuko na kwenye tunakaa it's only like 45 minutes hajafika it's been from from midnight till 3 am it's a long time tried calling simu inaingia but he doesn't pick he doesn't atukua na any issue at tumequarrel ama tumeletana juu we were the way people think you're in love the following morning he comes at at, at a, it was on a sunday he came on a sunday 9 am and came with unapata usingizi aje na nilikuwa huko nje nikamwambia i tried haven't you found over 20 missed calls hata kwa simu akaniambia at na kama siko anajisikia kupik nikamwambia how would i have known uko nje what is going on mimi hata naamka niende church on a sunday because it was on a sunday naamka niende church na tunaenda church na na, na mtoi and then he was like you hakuna mahali unaenda leo hiyo church nitakuja kukuaibisha ukijaribu ingie hiyo kanisa nitakuja nitasema na anaweza nitakuaibisha utajua hujui iki tanda hutoki nikamwambia wewe ndio umelala nje why are you turning tables that you don't want to tell me umelala nje and then you are attacking me akanigonga slap moto kama unaona kwa bed umefunikwa hivi umeshikiliwa hivyo so hawezi toa mikono mtu akiwa umelala na, na hii ni ni blanket alafu ulalie mtu juu unajua hawezi jitoa hapo have you ever tried mtu hata chali yako mkicheza ukwe ndani ya blanketi akulalie juu alalie hiyo blanketi hawezi jitoa hapo akiwa lie nilijaribu haiko mimi uso tu inagongwa hii slap inatani inagongwa hii ingine inatani <laughs> so hiyo <laughs> ndio time mtu yeye alisikia baba why are you slapping mom oh no she was big yes she was i think seven now oh ah, very big i chose nice for the first time i never went back again and now i started being nice one jerry i started building my esteem i moved out i i i i my brothers came supported me um my manager back then nani akaniambia itakuwa fiti though haku a lot kwa hizo issues juu pia unajua si manager wa maisha yangu ni manager wa career but angenipea encouragement you see and for the first time i didn't tell any friend what i'm doing I didn't tell anyone only a friend of mine mmoja anaitwa Meriana aliona hizo za za kugongwa makofi akaniambia wewe well, utidogo kiugogo kambia this time you will see and I talked to him as a grown up for the first time kambia I can't do with this I need separation and I I can't do this and I told you the next time you will hit me I will walk out of that gate and that was then and when I moved the only thing aliyeka kwa mtandao 
nimeingia ime MVC MVC him he ndio haikukuja hata na 50 cent hata dururu ya adhuiti Mm. Ya sweet ukuje ukule hivi hivi <laughs> nothing he knew that i was as broke as whatever but why put online that ati ati amepata kiburi pesa. amepata pesa ame nini ni nini you know i didn't have even pesa ya kuhama nilienda kuka kwa brother angu. you know those cases aka haribu jina huku nje aka call mabeshte wangu aka call other two jobs i lost two jobs two good contracts moja ilikuwa ya 50k ingine ilikuwa ya 80k i lost them because they said eh, i do not res- at nimepata pesa nikapata kiburi ya bwana nikasema sitawaiongelea sitaiongelea si, history because i will talk when i'm too bitter and there are things i will say so in short ladies when you you choose yourself things line up because when i chose myself and when i moved out and wh- when i chose myself and i said i will never go back to this again if people in Kenya have trusted me enough to give me AMVC and they can see I'm great why am I not seeing the greatness in me so that was in 2018 so he was the one who broke the news that you guys have separated online. yes yes online so guys i was saying that this interview turned to be very different <laughs> from the totally. interviews that you used to see from me Aki. Tuko tunapiga story ndio sasa tuanze interview because normally tunapiga nga story na guest uh-huh. then we start the interview yes. but i think the directors let us go na director awili waka feel <laughs> ah acha tuanze tukaamua twende tukiendanga <laughs> anyway we uh-huh. it's been it's been a long one we it's been a long one and uh-huh. i've never shared this i felt it's the high time uh-huh. as in nime heal kuna two places yes tutakufanya feel emotional maybe yeah. when you remember but Nime heal na naweza ambia wanawake wengine huko nje usigoje okay. that mm-hmm. long usigoje okay. what i would like to know like nis mm-hmm. you know mimi you amongst those people who used to inspire me so much Aww. and it hurts me so much kujua like you are going through a lot mm-hmm. your time to knock on anti boss with all smiles exactly <laughs> like how are you juggling unajua um i think it's i kept my focus on the dream more than what i was going through i i i i, I think sababu when your first born na umelelewa na kuficha vitu za familia yenu because tulificha condition ya kina mom for long yeah. you you feel there is no need for people to know that side of you you feel the happy side should be the first thing that people see mm-hmm. and i maintain that through social media i maintain that through even some friends when i meet them mm-hmm. but how i used to juggle i think what gave me more power and more pushes me my dream because i had a dream if because i knew if i stop doing what i do that is acting and being on anti boss doing what i do because nilikuwa nafika set sikudanganyi nilikuwa nafika set kwanza naacha nice na hapo ju nice akiingia set hata work unaona different people have seen me broken in one way or another but they never said anything they they just a hug sometimes you can just hug someone na hiyo kitu iishe na muendelee kushoot and i would tell people that it was my career and my child that really pushed me to be niweze kuficha that side mm-hmm. until inafika time i people see you so strong it's the high time it's been now in hiyo kitu ilisha see i'm not going on i'm not going through the same thing see si chap we si feel inferior si feel down anymore and i found love i still believed in love i found love and it's amazing this is the feeling i would want every lady to experience every man to experience that what it means to be truly loved mm-hmm. it means you are untouchable it's lazima umu explain me what is really happening mm. you don't tell them the whole truth mm. you still push them to love their father because that is their father yes but you still focus on um, mm. mostly um making them understand where we are why we are not in that house where we are why we Tuanze. are in this house mm-hmm. okay mm-hmm. so uh, you were telling us how you managed to keep all the smiles mm-hmm. parent boss mm-hmm. kila mtu anaona uko na furaha you know you're doing mm-hmm. the adverts mm-hmm. despite going through a lot back in your marriage mm-hmm. um, it was all dream the dream yangu ndio ile ni keep awake because i have a dream yenye mimi nimeteseka sana tukiwa wa young So for me it's in a luxury ya kukaa chini and not working because I'm emotional or I'm stressed. Even when I had depression 
there was a time hiyo time ya depression nilienda nilikuwa na mtu naongelesha na nitafutia tu mtu tu anti depressant ndio nilale for like six months you know hizo vitu zote ukipitia hakuna mtu unataka ajue sana cuz I, I, i felt like when you put your shit let me just call it for lack of a better word uko inje sana ikikuhapenia it doesn't go well so nili, uh, unless when you are close to me ndio walikuwa wanajua wenye tuna work nao mm-hmm. pale Kenya National Theater wenye kama watu wenye wako close na mimi and boss ndio wangejua but my dream ndio ile nifanya i think ni maintain hiyo mm-hmm. yote na mtoi sasa mm-hmm. niko na kaangalia hivi na nataka kukapea future si kupata you see tulilelewa na kikuyu you know and then i wanted that to know good english asingo ange kama saa zingine sisi kuna tu wengine tunaponyokaga uko zile what the hell so i wanted her to have a good life and for her to have a good life i can't afford if to sit down and just because of my emotions and because i'm depressed and just i sit down my career will go down if i don't work if i don't use this mouth to work or i don't make people happy uko nje with my career that means i do not have money so that's what pushed me to, to mm-hmm to really not for anyone to see it as mm-hmm. fans but they see a different kind of nice mm-hmm. maybe mm-hmm. to wrap up a uh, history of their marriage and everything mm-hmm. and what happened mm-hmm. you can tell us uh, you've mentioned that he's the one who put out yes, the, yes, yes, the yes, information yes, yes. Yes. that you guys have separated mm-hmm. and of course mm-hmm. akakweka kama the bad person yes. and everything mm-hmm. you only handle aje mm-hmm. na pia uh, did you ever maybe at any point kuisema kwa mtanao ama this is going to be the first time um after Ali announced I didn't talk for the first day I think the second day I stayed longer without saying anything I didn't go to any interview I used to be called so I used to nalenga hata nikiwa hiyo time nilikuwa idagariene so my friend hata alikuwa ananichia simu juu bloggers sijui hata walitoa namba yangu wapi from whatsapp nini nini can we interview you and sikuiongelea why si I, siku kana isemekane ni pesa nimepata siku and i i had time to breathe in mato pia ni manager hapo akaniambia ina haja why why are you why should i explain myself mm. i was in this marriage for nine months nine or years. Ka, nine, nine, nine years i was for this uh, we call it marriage because it was come and stay it doesn't mean when you stay with such a person we call it marriage or a relationship for nine years and these people were not involved and if i start talking now i'm still angry because i'm still hurt that he can dare say such a thing and he knows the truth what really happened because he knew i can never speak up unajua kikana mtu miaka 9 nane ana 9 years anajua i if we is ongea nice hata why why courage apate what he knew i can't see him paint that kwa watu unaona i have gotten calls not calls uh, in boxes za nini za ijizi kiniambia hi ati ati I've, i've met your ex and i can truly say he was the bad na, na ujui haujui ni to dem to rembo tunakaa tumebeba my friend to rembo sana unasikia mtu anakuambia ati ati thank god you left now you don't know them i don't reply such texts because for what unaona and so if why siku yongelea kwa upa nilienda tu kwa um, masawe japani nikaongelea tu the disrespect part because when you're disrespected kuna hiyo side ya disrespect ni ni, ni noma i didn't talk kwa upana ju siku nime heal saa hizi it's been long mm. and i can tell now ladies when i'm strong what i went through to help another one person out there i don't want to help the whole of kenya women i just want one woman who is going through what i went through and thinks that it's her fault to just forgive themselves for allowing that to happen to them because they have they, i would have chosen myself i would have loved myself but i didn't know why until i met people who showed me that they, I, i am lovable and i can be loved na kwa period yote yenye mko na issues and everything were you guys sharing photos together online Mhm. Unaenda saa zingine mnapigwa picha hata hiyo ya time nime win MBCA. <laughs> yes, you take photos together I still I used to attend his karaoke is bado. But sasa after sasa ame announce hapo ndio sasa nilikata sikuwahi 
where he post anything and then I deleted all his photos mm -hmm. unless someone has tagged me where I can't be able to delete the photo I deleted because I need a peace of mind mm -hmm. peace of mind Ile. I wish people would know what peace means peace is amazing women you can understand me when you have peace so I was still posting before he announced when Tuliachan and Dio Sasa Mimi Nili Kata so you guys used to but say to the world that you're, you're okay. Good. You're okay. You're mm -hmm. okay. Because that's how to attend events. Mpige picture hapa pale. Alafu alikuwa na... Nobody uh, ever leaked. Unajua kama sa easy. Mm -hmm. uh, maybe just for example. Mm -hmm. Me and Trevor go somewhere. Mm -hmm. uh, involved in a fight. Kama hivyo mlikuwa muna fight. No nini. one leaked. Somebody will record. Nini. Back then I took too much into when fight comes. You mm -hmm. pick your phone first. No. Mm -hmm. It was 2018 for God's sake. Ni really uliku unaona watu wa kishu. Siku hizi ndio yiko sana. Mm. So ata wenye wali ndio kuna mdosi wangu wa jichof. Oh, I mean wafanaka ata lijua. Iyo kidonda yiko hapa si dirisha. And it was mdosi wa uko wa mkubwa mwenye fanaka. Uo ndio alijua sababu. A fan aliniona nikigongewa uko. Aka, alafu waka nikuta stage nikia atambia hii. Kale kwa stana ni kastrong, jana kamegongwa wo. Hei ule hazi yake ni no. Hei, na badu wamepata ngugu. Respect kwa uyo demu. So uyo demu diyo later, no one would want to say it. Ni, na kwambia nilikuwa na watu wanaisema na ikata. Nilikuwa na watu wanataka kuni support ni hame lakini nakata. So why, alafu nikikata badu nitaenda kuwasema kwa ex. Ni, hivyo li niambia tia tu Mimi na wewe si mwajinga Nini nini likuwa nataka ni kuache So basically ya kukua na watu wana, Na wenye wange shoot Hakukua na mtanda wati sasa kume, kume Tunashare tuna Tunaanikana like right Hei kama hey, si right na Right na wata mimi nikipata watu pale wana fight Kwanza ni shoot <laughs> Lakini kwanza ni taingilia Saizi mila yaza ingilia hizo fight za watu Because I know what it does Whether whoever was wrong Grown ups should not fight Mm -hmm. Let's talk amicably. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. So, so right now, Annie, mm -hmm. you are in love. Yes. Of course, there are so many people who, when they get out of such relationship, mm -hmm. they find it hard mm -hmm. to love again. Mm -hmm. But you are, uh, you are loved. Mm -hmm. uh, you are expecting a bundle oh, of yes, joy. Yes. Maybe you can tell us how has it been now? Any the transition? The transition. Hey, transition was hard at first. In first year. Hey, pole akileti nili sumbua huyo mwana ume. Nili msumbua because I could not believe that a man can come and love me. For you, for, for who me. you are. Nili kwa nashina ni kimuja, niya yako ni gani? Mm, niya yako ni gani? Hata ile time tuko kwa hoteli ama nini na wambi, ama umetafuta mtu wa shuti kitu unyanike. Ana niashua, like it took him, for him, mi ni believe u kijana na nipenda. It took the whole family even for my brothers. It took my brothers, my, my, now the, the, unajua kuna wale family, si, si damu lakini they are your brothers and your sisters. It took them, ile enye kuni, kuni, kuni ambia, ukweli uyu anakupenda ya ukweli. Aki, ame, ame, one year, ame prove. Ame prove kabisa, Latin was there, Latin loved me, Latin did, Latin loved my daughter. Alikuwa nakaona hivi ya nasema, oh my god, why would you hit such a face? Alikuwa naniambia, do you know how great you are, even your career, your... I, did, I never knew I was that great. Umewin, sasa ndiyo alianza kunionesha, by the way after AMVC, after sasa tumeachana, kwa nini uliwine AMVC? Yendi alianza kunionesha that I am great, I'm good, I'm, 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 I'm lucky to be alive and I'm, 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 I should get love. And because I, I, I had not given up on love, but I wanted to, I didn't want love anymore because going through that, you don't go back. Most of the people don't go back. And then he won my heart through the way he loves Natasha. He won my way by telling me to do stuff that I was not ready to do. Even shooting, I was not ready. Nilipotea kwanza mtanda ukiasi. And then we started shooting. And when we were shooting, we were not dating. We were just friends. Where friends come in and akujanga see wimba and a kujanga karaoke ako hata hata moja. Your time will na wak. That's the only livelihood in Gepata I could host karaoke because I was I, I'm courageous even before kuonge ambele ya watu so ikuwa noma. And my brothers kept on now. Nikama nilipata system 
support system mpya hiyo time one year i was so broken i would get panic attacks if katikati ya usiku ina naamka niko naanza i can't breathe because na, na the near the life i'm living ya kupendwa it's 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 a dream and i'm still na yeye it's ba, hizo panic attacks ni mbaya Uki, nikipita a certain road najua anaweza kuwa hiyo side na nashindwa ku breathe it's either unigutushe either na kuni shake ama ku breathe in nice ile kitu ya nini brother yangu alikuwa amezoea letina meiona first hand usiku 3 am na kaa hivi machozi inanitoka analiza ni nini nawaambia i am so broken inside I don't think anyone can 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 mend that and after that when now i was sure i was loved yani it's the beautiful feeling ever you feel secure you feel protected a man should protect you a man should protect you from the outside world a man should be there for you when the rest are against you a man should show even other women that this is my woman that you should not uh, Trevor should not allow other women attack you on behalf of him yeye ndio awakate wewe ukue safe wewe wewe ufai kufungua hii mdomo unaingilia mwanamke mwingine na maybe aliambiwa Trevor ako single kwa nini say chicks have no problem with you i hawana they don't they sh- you should not even talk to them whatever they were told they were told you should just have a bond with your person and that bond huyo huyo mtu kuna watu wana to damage kwa roho and then we are, are we supposed to remain the same for sure no but right now aki i'm happy aka kabandol it, it took longer for me to carry another child that's something me na letin to li take longer we needed to be okay mentally both of us mm-hmm. how long have you been in a relationship now um we started dating 2019 mm. yes 2019 so tunaenda mwaka ya ile ku date kabisa ku date mwaka ya nne ifunguke sasa nzuri mm-hmm. eh yeah. juu tulianzana na yeye huko towards eh eh, 2019 20 20 2021 2022 sasa hii ni nini so miaka nne hazija lock kabisa mm-hmm. hija lock eh. mm-hmm. and bado hata kama nimemuitikia bado nilikuwa na hizo issues and he didn't leave he he was there he supported me with everything he he became that light yenye i needed at the end of the tunnel and for sure if a man comes and they give you that mm-hmm. please take it mm-hmm. you're safe it's not a must trust you itikia kupendwa pia juu kuna watu wako na broken huku nje wakipendwa hawaitiki kupendwa how is the relationship between him and your daughter Hey, very nice. Very nice. Unajua niki eh, eh, nasemanga hivi ingekuwa rahisi pia yeye kuisema. <laughs> But on my side how I see it, they are very close. They take drives. Yaani unafauona venye yeye welcome you home na our daughter. Kai anaingia nga tu hobu hivyo unasikia Tasha huko igwe the king is home in the morning she can't live without kissing us bye uh, i have to let us tunaandikia angwa nyuma dear mom or dad as in they're so close to an extent of i wish that fathers would love their daughters the way letting loves natasha Mm-hmm. What about uh, Natasha right now? She's mm-hmm. grown and by the time you are leaving the previous relationship, mm-hmm. she was already uh, grown mm-hmm. to a point you would tell the dad not yes. to hit you. Mm-hmm. Does she understand what happened? She kind of she she still remembers those slaps mm, and at some point she said I will do, I don't want to meet people who are hurting my mom. And at, at some point I was taken to child welfare, children's welfare and tukagawana uh, hata time ya kuonanga mtoto ni sina had no man na kuona mtoto juu tuliandikiana take ya school fees na niswe iongeleshwa na shule cuz nikasema ni, ni, ni sawa kama hiyo ndio uko na uwezo sawa mimi hii side nyingine ya food na manguo na kwenye anaka kuna shida na kwenye anaka ni poa ni, ni sawa 
nita 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 tikia kia tutatikia kia that with the mm. team and that was on 2020 now 19 towards the end mm. upon the early nipeleka children's welfare and i was okay with that but aliona tu mtoto two weeks mm. from there he has never 20 from 2020 he has never ever called to talk to the wakati mtoto alifukuzwa shule alipe school fees upon the early block here sasa zaidi juu tuliandikiana mm. if mtoto amefukuzwa nikipewa like any, any anything ya shule ni sim call ni take it kama kama ka video ni msendie via whatsapp for accountability ndio isikuwe hizi back and forth tukitukanana kwa simu ama anitukane ama nimtukane a uh-uh, a i want a clean nini we move on with your life because he had moved on way before ni vile haikuwa naunsiwa so you move on your side and me please um toto wacha guru mimi sita kuharibia jina kwa mtoto wako na wewe usiniharibie jina kwa mtoto wangu whatever she so she so i can't rub that out of her mind you see but they have seen each other i think maybe uko from 2020 till now maybe twice ile kubampiana ku, ku somewhere ah. yes they bump into each other zile za hi hi nini 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 they will have a good time not bye. planned <laughs> he never asks those things he doesn't ask for any meeting he doesn't because he stopped paying school fees he doesn't take yeah, care of anything yes okay, okay. so he stopped totally he doesn't call neither all and 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 now tasha is grown and she would constantly say mom kwani who is the groom she should also call you ni kwani ni mimi tu nampigia simu and then i suggested you can buy him a ha kabambe ukitaka kukola unapiga juu sa zingine si mimi na wako si kupiga simu yangu na siko home si i just tell you siko home unaona na nikifika sa zingine mtoto amelala asubuhi akienda shule si lazima muonge na si anajua shule yake na sinie yako so the guardian si afike alipe siku waongee na mtoto you know we complicate these things so much ni kama lazima ni meet ndio meet mtoto wako no 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 mm. no from 2020 has never taken care of that child ever ever is for kwa last year ali buy toys after we meet huku mahali tu ka buy toys kadhaa hapo ni kwa zile za okay toys zitalea ni sawa Yeah, and 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 for some reason Latin was like if this thing continues me hana noma kukana huyo jamaa wa bonge wajue ju tasha anajua kuna two dads anajua na it, it doesn't change na national nikimwambia me what happened between me and your father has nothing to do with you you are a bright child you are loved you are okay nini nini but tasha will keep on telling me mom the last time i went to kwa kwake alianza kuniambia atakufungisha kwa polisi na utafungwa ndio anichukue mom and then when she comes back she's different ako ana tat na tasha ni hugging girl very jovial nini nini mom aliniambia ni si why ni si why jaribu atakuongea ata kitu ni, ni atakupeleka kwa polisi na hiyo ni kupea mtoto trauma fulani mtoto ametuona tukienda children's welfare ameona makarau and then unamemwambia utapeleka mama yake polisi umfungishe sijakataa umit sijakataa uangalie mtoto so it's i think he was looking for their spite and then god worked his way i don't have a problem him staying away and me going on with my life because he was in a calm person where you can have conversations no he will always want to be the winner and hurt you mm-hmm. in the process mm-hmm. so i don't meet him i don't see him i don't see his social media i haven't i think maybe his face i've seen it maybe by by mistake ile ile niko area maybe na pita maybe uko kikuyu na maybe akuwe mahali uone face yake la boss ni ni, ni latin uona aya or aya yuko aya and i i stopped feeling hiyo kitu kia kuwa iliacha iliacha mm-hmm. okay as we conclude uh, nice um, there's this push, uh, comment that i've been seeing especially to your pre interview mm-hmm. that you did with mm-hmm. kyoko mm-hmm. there's some people who have been commenting mm-hmm. oh there's a time you united kenya sijui nini nikashanga nikashanga what is happening where did i unite kenyans so um i think it was was it 20 i think it was 2019 there was allegedly a, a, a sex tape that was leaked and people said it was sure one to both so it went viral by the way i don't know how many people saw it but uh, the two youngsters think they know who nice wanjeri is ama venyana kama nini and uh, for some reason when i looked at that lady 
watu walikuja inbox wakiniambia wanamjua yes mm. and 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 uh, just like veje si hata akothe aliwekelewa yake akaambua pia yeye ni yeye mm. i don't need to explain mm. myself and say that was more i know it wasn't me so that's enough as long as i know and my people know that was not me and my friends who are close mm. i don't need to explain to haters and 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 fans who are just waiting for my downfall to tell them yo that is not me please please i cry no as long as you know it wasn't you that's enough so whoever niliona hiyo comment but i laugh cuz they come also on my side mm. side yangu and when i look at their photos ni to chali tudogo to enye mostly their job right now is masturbating mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I have nothing else to uh-huh. say. Yeah. Anyway, maybe you can tell us as a person how are you faring right now? Mm-hmm. You're no longer mm-hmm. on the garene, mm-hmm. anti boss purely talker. Like what are you doing currently? Currently I'm online. Currently I want to grow my YouTube channel. I want to shoot more stuff that CJ employee you are I want to how far can I go? That's my point. How far can I go without limitation? Cuz sijakata tv tv ni poa hata saa hizi nikipata tv i will still go back majaliwa ya mwenyezi mungu mm-hmm. but respect ni very important kwenye na work pia nita nikupe respect ni pay respect au nitafanya kazi venye inafaa cuz mimi sijaiangusha kazi ni wana shawa ni pay beat ni 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 endorsement ama nini nifanye sijaiangusha game i always do my job well and hapo ndio mimi najivunianga and um I'll say online is my thing. Sa hizi tunatoka TV. In in 5 or 10 years to come, I think online will be our TV. Mostly hata sa hizi if kwako sa hizi how many times do you sit down and watch TV? Yeah. See? See none. You use your phone to maybe Netflix ile uko bored and maybe you watch one episode and sleep because you're tired. So with the same case to my daughter right now she says I'm um, she's not a TV person and this is to TV person she's a YouTube person and she can use a phone to join whatever she's joining I'm watching whatever she's joining so in short the where we are going it's more of online so I'm really now trying to come up with my own way of shooting getting my own crew yenye tutatengeneza tukuwe na anaza ni kama si production ya nice ni kama production ya nice but iko na watu wenye unainua pale ajikimu kimaisha au inue mwingine hii side ajikimu mm-hmm. kimaisha is the transition hard like mm-hmm. coming from tv now you have to uh, yes. get to online yes yes it is it is hard it is hard because now you have to convince your audience whatever you are mm-hmm. saying there i'm still the same person and i'm still actually doing better mm-hmm. it, it, it takes time to pick up it takes time to pick up mm-hmm. and when you look at so many actors right now they are changing the narrative Mm. of like uh, people if i taja a few kit actress unless maybe you put a netflix you really see how in a program program yenye iko programmed for for cause ma- mostly there is a lot of content she's creating every single day unless it's a movie higher class yenye itaenda netflix mm. nini na me grow sana kukuwa tu kwa kipindi dogo yeah, you wanna wait in in a time ku shoot kwa tv in a time more na ukikuwa kwa tv ni hard ku juggle ati ukikuwa set umuamue wacha leo nifanye ma tiktok zangu ama ni inakuanga so hard because your mind is glued to this script so kujigawanisha akili inakuwa you either give one less and the other one more so when you're not on tv it is easier transition mm-hmm. is hard but once you get it you get it mm-hmm. it's it, it, it good what to pia si lazima tv Akina crazy kena desagu au wote ni watu wame wame wameingia wame online without TV and they have made it. Mhm. Akina akina yani you yourself you haven't been in any TV. Uko kwa TV zetu tukitabu kwa mm. kwa TV zetu. Mm. So it doesn't mean because you're not uh, on TV you you can't be that person. Actually watu wengi watakusikiza huku nje mm-hmm. ni wenye wako online kuliko TV. TV iko limited. Mm-hmm. You can as well post whatever you want to post social media. TV you can. Mm-hmm. Mm. Okay, maybe you can talk to your fans. Mm-hmm. Uh, I'm sure most of them will be happy to get to know your story. <laughs> Najua wengi hawajui, hawajui. Wengi hawajui. Exactly. So, my fans, I want to talk to the ladies and gents because domestic <laughs> violence is not for a certain gender men are going through this women are going through this i will say this and i will say from the bottom of my heart please ikifikia hapo toka 
Jipenda ina the minute it starts with loving yourself. I took longer to love myself. So start early and know that you're as important as your partner. Pia wanaume msinyamaze tu mnateswa huku nje unakuwa na depression. Hii kitu kingine mnajikuta mumeua. Cuz mimi nilikuwa nime contemplate venye eh akiwa melala naweza mdunga kisu ama naweza chukua curtain rod ni mgonge kichwa. But sasa ukimgonga mkesi atakuwa nao. So that means umeenda jela ama ameenda jela ama you, we have seen easy cases kule kwa mitandao and we call it love to a triangle. Let's it's not a love. Yes, call it love triangle. It's it's bad. Just love yourself enough to walk away and also continue following me pale Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, beat kwote wananiita nice wanjeri. Niko na song mpya pale ya mapenzi. Sasa hii nimependwa napendeka. Niko na furaha jameni. Ai. <laughs> na nimebeba kadogo hapa. Mhm. Mm iko pale kwa my youtube channel nice wanjeri na jo usitonyekea link lazima yes ataeka link hivi ataeka link watch it subscribe like more to come mm -hmm. yes thank you so much uh, guys unfortunately we didn't have an intro to this <laughs> video but anyway it's a wrap uh, make sure you hit that subscribe button we we'll meet in the next video bye bye bye